All right, everyone, it is I, Shroyer Jazz of Bounds, and today, we're going to be continuing right where we left off with Trails of Cold Steel 2. Now, um, we are getting very close to the end of this game. Yeah, we do not have too much to go at all, in fact, um, like, we are about, like, how many chapters now? Like, so we completed uh, the, um, oh yeah, that's right. So last time, we started searching for the Zemirian Ore to, uh, you know, fix up Valmar's main weapon. And, uh, you know, get him the uh, proper Tachi that he deserves. And really needs, because here's the thing. Um, here, here's the big thing. He cannot perform at his best with just a mere Panzer Soldat sword. No, no, no. He has to have this fancy sword that we're going to have to make ourselves. And that is pretty much, um, pretty much the, uh, main thing here we're trying to do is, uh, you know, nice. make, um, is trying to find the Sumerian Ore and, you know, make that actually happen. However, um, you know, after we did find the ore and, you know, locate all of, um, locate a few of the lost, um, well, we did complete the tasks and, you know, save hostages and, and all that other stuff as well. And also locate a few of the, uh, other students from Thor's Military Academy who managed to make it out. Um, we immediately got a call regarding Seldic, or rather Keldic. That being that apparently Duke Alborea had given direct orders to torch the entire town. Now, and while, you know, the majority of his citizens did manage to escape, uh, sadly, um, Baron Otto was not so lucky. Baron Otto's dead. He was killed in the, uh, he was killed in the attack. So, yeah, in our words, to uh, prevent any more atrocities from happening and to also, you know, um, to also avenge Otto and to uh, make sure that and just basically, you know, punish Duke Alborea for what he's done, we decided to um, go ahead and, you know, um, go ahead and raid Oryx Fort where he was holed up. Tried to hold both us and the Imperial Army off. And immediately upon uh, upon trying to enter, we were of course confronted first by Supreme Colonel Scarlet, who had her own personal vendetta with Reed to sell. Uh, and luckily, we were able to defeat her, but not kill her. Unlike Vulcan, who uh, did unfortunately die, uh, as you all know. And, uh, then after that, of course, we, you know, uh, got to, um, we then, of course, had to, uh, challenge Duvali. That was a bit harder than I expected, but, eh, it wasn't that bad. But all in all, in the end, we managed to, you know, uh, you know, dethrone Duke Alborea, or, you know, uh, remove him from power. And now, um, and now, Eustace has pretty much taken over, uh, the role of interim leader uh, after this. So, yeah. Um, that pretty much leads us right where we are now. Oh, yeah. There was also the whole thing about the big tree, too. Uh, damage to the giant tree. Yeah. Yeah, apparently it's related to whatever's going on in Crossbell, which, as I said before, that's going to be for a whole other game. And we did also get our first uh, glimpse at Tessa Rosa, too. And I'm going to tell you right now, but Duke Cayenne is up to something really, really bad. Like, some really bad shit. And uh, a lot of people are in danger, so yeah. Um, but anyway, let's get into this. Let's actually do this here. Oh yeah, we also did do uh, one of the... Um, one of the, uh, oh, what was it? Um, one of the quests, that's right. Yeah, we did one of the quests as well. 
where we managed to, uh, where we did face off against Nosferatu again, but this time we did manage to defeat him because one, we're playing on the easiest difficulty, and two, uh, you know, you know, um, we were actually properly prepared, unlike last time. But yeah, let's get at this. Let's actually do this. So our next quests are either So yeah, we have to clear out a giant monster in Ars Canyon Path, which Do we ever face anything called a Volsara before? I don't think we have. I guess we'll find out. I don't know. Where do you want to go? Big red lines, of course, the uh, Erebonius borders. And then there's Nord Highlands. Full speed ahead. On second thought, no. No, not yet. How <laughs> was get confused with this menu? Tree's appearance sure is spooky, but we can't let it stop us from what, doing what we have to. We need to reset our efforts on the spirit shrines. Yep. Where do you want to but go? first, we need to finish up all the quests. All right, where, where's our first one? Arx Canyon Path. Huh? Where do you want to go? We're going back to uh, the destroyed town of Caldic. I will say, it's still very jarring seeing, you know, Keldic completely destroyed. You know, like, tons of people have been killed. Like, Keldic is just in ruins. And it's super haunting because, you know, just, just a few hours ago, hell, not even that, or rather, you know, like, Mere days. Well, like, you know, like, two days, I guess, in game time. Celtic was a happy, you know, fun place. Like, there was nothing too bad going on. Like, sure, the Imperial Army was everywhere, but they were trying to keep people safe. And now everything's just gone. Also, I don't know why my uh, computer keeps freezing. Thank you so much for coming, everyone. I assume you saw my... My request. Sure did. Still trying to organize a concert here, huh? And you want my input as well, right? That's correct. I realize you're all busy, but would you be able to help us with this? Of course! It'd be a pleasure! 
Anything to help the townsfolk! It would be my pleasure to help you, the Croizen citizens. Thank you so much, everyone. Only a few days have passed since the town was attacked, yet repair efforts are already on the way. The RP has been... The RP has been providing us with relief supplies, while braces for the guild visit from time to time as well. Good! This town needs all the support it could get. Kelly does seem to at least be a little better sight than when it, we last saw it. Ah, Claire's so nice! Good to hear the guild's helping out too! That being said, it's clear the townsfolk are still shaking for the attack. Of course they are! They're, they're like, their own government attacked them! Well, like you said, it's only been a few days, and again! You know, it's their own government. Like, the Croatian provincial government themselves attacked the town. Like, these are the guys they trusted. I don't really expect anyone to recover from events so horrifying that quickly. That's why I've been desperately trying to find a way to help heal the scars and traumatic experience left. And I'm not going to voice all the lines, obviously, because that would take way too long. So I am going to breeze through a lot of this. Realize we could just run to Brea hard, right? I mean, there's nothing stopping us from doing so. This spot looks perfect for fishing. But yeah, we're gonna need a lot of people anyway, because like we're gonna have to, you know, search everyone for. Um, right, we're gonna have to, you know, search uh, everywhere for, you know, suits from the uh, orchestra. We're gonna have to search, like, you know, quite a few different places. So, you know, stay on guard, everyone. That's no ordinary foe. What the fuck? Did we see that plant guy, um, like way back in Brayard? <gasps> this one looks like a toughie. Perfect. Here I go. Let's see. Ah! Leave it to me. You know what? We might have to use this. Shit. My turn.
Let's see. True armor breaker! Hell yeah, alright. Let's see, uh, let's do Pluto, and, um, who else could stand a little, uh, from a little leveling up? Shadow, the Edgehog, and Machias, even though I'm probably never going to use him, but we should level him up anyway. There's a treasure chest close by. And unfortunately, uh, the Countess with her big meaty sword can't uh, be switched out for anyone, so we're pretty much uh, stuck with her for now. Here we go. Let's move. Who acts the Asher? Leave this to me. Hell yeah! It's my turn. They're open. You're done. My turn. Guess we're safe. Perfect. <laughs> I'm success. <laughs> yes. I spy with my little eye the goods. All right, let's do this. Enemy sighted. Let's take him out. Let's move. Alright. 
Here we go. Huh. Let's see. Flash grenade or you know, let's let's do a flash grenade. So, I don't know why my computer keeps uh, having micro stutter. That's very weird. Ah! Hell yeah! Rock Sash? Too slow. Now. Okay, got it. All right. Leave it to me. <laughs> One down. Uh, let's see. Ah! Holy! That actually did quite a lot of damage. Too slow. Let's move. I think my I think my graphics card's starting to die. Oh, you know I say this all the time, but I generally do this time. Now, an opening. You're finished. Leave it to me. All right, let's see. My turn. Now. Here. Perfect. And Jesus, that that much XP, huh? That much experience. I did it. No complaints here. Success. <laughs> A matter of exactly how it should be. Also, one thing I do want to talk about with this game is, um... Yeah, I'll, I'll talk about uh, a little later when we actually, you know, get to, like, um... If we actually do get there. But there is actually some major issues with pacing that I do want to discuss. Like, not really pacing, more of just the way the game is, uh, is, like, written. Stay on and guard, or uh, things are That's no played out, control. I guess. Like the order of events is what I'm getting Watch at. Out. Here. This is a tough one. Okay. Here I go. Perfect. Now. Okay, guys. Right. 
Let's move. Hell yeah, all right. Onward. For the most part. Get off guard. Got you. All right. Now. You're done. Damn it! God damn it! All right. Target's eliminated. Let's get going. Huh? Elisa, Elliot, Laura, Eusis. I do like the way the uh, little plant guys are designed, at least. Like, they, they have very... I don't know. Like, their design's kind of weird, and I kind of like it. A little bit. Eliminating targets. Now. Hell yeah! Let's move. God! How'd you miss that? I was right in front of you! What the hell? That shouldn't have missed at all. Leave this to me. You still have a lot of training to do. Could probably fish here. I love the Countess. Like, I do love Laura. And for good reason. I mean, her sword is huge. And each slash does, like, again. How did you miss that? It's my turn. Oh, now it's just bugging on me. All right. I see what's going on. You're mine. I'll handle it. Yeah, game's bugging. I'll handle it. Hostiles neutralized. Guess we're safe. enough encephalon. Like, her normal encephalon levels aren't that great. We're gonna have to really, uh, improve them. Let's move. Huh. Perfect! Hell yeah! Okay, it's safer now. Yeah, I definitely think my PC was, like, damaged when the, um... Now's our chance. 
chance. Let's get him. Here I go. Ah, clash. Oh. still have a lot of training to do. Alright, because we're right outside Beret Hard. The Bird at Sea. Nice to see in the game, like okay, Roar is you know nice in its own way, but this has to be like next to Heimdall. This has to be like the nicest overall city in any of the games. Just because like just look at this. Absolutely beautiful. There you are. Good day, youngsters. Come to hear my beautiful melody from my fiddle, have we? Um, a fiddle, you say? Those differ somewhat from violins, don't they? They're certainly similar, but their differences are significant. Oh! <laughs> oh, damn! Someone's gagging to play. Uh, fee, that was kind of the wrong choice of words there. It might be just what we need. Sorry, but can we ask you for a favor? Mm, do go on. I'm all ears. Ah, so that's your plan. Well, I could hardly turn a request like that down. R really? Why, of course! Kelly's Grand Market used to be my most treasured stage, you see? Yep. He's more than a little odd. Then again, a lot of nobles are eccentric, so... I don't know, you know? Just how nobles be. Just how nobles are. Yeah, we're just doing what we can't do in the war. <laughs> Say what you will, your actions will bring the wrath of the noble lines upon you, no matter your intent. Alright, he's for a different quest. Right. That's right. Where do you want to go? Uh, Leave it 
it to me. Next stop, Roar. All right, that guy has to be around. Right, he's um, yeah, that residence. Or they are, rather. Well, hello, everyone. What a pleasure to see you. Is there something I could help you with? Oh, oh? A concert for the people of Celtic? I've heard terrible rumors about what happened there. Truly really awful what happens to these people. We are honored to play as the supervisor of Thor's Wind Orchestra. We greatly appreciate your help. By the way! By the by? <laughs> by the by? Is there any chance? Uh, I think they meant by the way, not by the by. Uh, by the way, is there any chance you've got an instrument you can play on you? I do, in fact, I brought a flute with me from the academy. I'm not bad if I do say so myself, Buster. That should sound great! Fine by me, I'll be pressing in the meantime, Jimbo. Time to bow, boss. <laughs> Alright, shall we head to our next destination? Of all the characters to give a New York accent, I decided her. Because why the hell not? And I decided Celine too, but that's more for just Frank Fontaine. So she just kind of does take the role of the, uh, directing benefactor. You know, the Frank Fontaine, pretty much. Right. Okay. My turn. Leave this to me. It's my turn. Okay. Let's move. My turn. Also... <laughs> Sorry, this, this place cracks me up every time. Still cannot believe that's actually his name. Okay. Now the last one's gonna be a little bit trickier. Wait up. Hang on here! Oh, hello! Hey, Hugo! Oh yeah! Huh. Huh. 
How about we help this? Yeah! Well, we'll be helping. Ha <laughs> ha! I think you are onto something there! Legram and Lemire are my last two. I've had just to touch base with my contacts in all the major locations already. All you do is find my rep the person representing each town's merchants and vendors. I get them to sign one of these. Hell yeah, alright. Which, yeah, we're also going to be completing the side quests, which... That's another major point of complaint for me. Because, you see, here's the big problem with the side quests. You might not notice it, but they do not list... Like, they list all the main quests. But they don't list any of the side ones for stuff. Like, they don't list, um... Yeah, that's right. They don't list, uh, you know, any of the uh, character quests for any of the students. Like, um, or really anyone of that nature. Like, they just straight up just don't even bother. Which I, feel, which I find really quite odd. Like, you know, they, they put all this work into displaying, you know... All the jazz for, like, the main stuff, like, you know, the, uh, airship rescue and all that. But yet, little Kleisenko and all those people, they don't even get on the board. Where do you want to go? Just like, I don't know, like, Hawkeye did that better because they actually did, you know, display them fully. And a bunch of other stuff, uh, did way better. But I don't know, since we're already in Nortia, we, we should go to Ymir first. To Infinity and your mom! Ymir has a nice theme. Far away, the more bit exciting the products are. Oh yeah, that's there you are. Hi, Lord Reen. Can I get you something? Actually, there's something I would like you to talk about. Huh? That sounds actually a pretty good idea. We've been having a harder time getting stuff in lately, but it's clear we aren't the only ones. We're together a common problem like this is the best way to go forward. I definitely agree, like... Then? then I think I could have a look at the contract. Hell yeah! All right, now let's just stop in Legram, and then Kleist is gonna be on the on the ship. I don't know what's causing the lag. You know what? I'm gonna check. on earth is going on? No, it just seems to be this game. Yeah, I don't know. Probably nothing to worry about, as far as I know. Now, as long as my PC is still showing somewhat signs of life, 
I don't think we're gonna have to worry. Where do you want to go? Uh -huh. Leave it to me. While we're um, on the ship, we're gonna have to buy uh, some new weapons, by the way. I just realized that. Ah, if it isn't like you know, uh, something I can help you with? That's my fact, yes. Well, now, this is interesting. So it makes sense for us merchants to come together. Gladly! Hell yeah. So now the merchants of uh, Erebonia are all banned together! To, you know, make sure that goods get to people, even in these trying times. Quite a beautiful thing to watch. Where do you want to go? Full speed ahead. Oh, you're back. I think you were able to get some fresh ink. On those contracts, then. Sure did. Here you go. Oh, these are perfect. Thanks for taking care of that for me. That was quite the run around. Ugh. Well, at least we're done now. I will. I've already made everyone. Com oh. I've all <laughs> I cannot speak today. I've already made everyone at the company aware of my travel itinerary. I'll take a thought. Could you help me with something, Reed? Oh, that's actually just what we needed. Hell yeah! Alright. There we go. That should do it! Nice. Okay, there is one... Oh, hi, Becky! Don't you hey Becky May with that cool ass to yours away, man! First, you decide to roll on out of nowhere, and then you get the bright idea to start shop shop right next to me. Hey, what's the issue? This is the only spot. Ah, we both. Yeah, exactly. Typical Hugo! Alright. Done, Dustin! Now I find, um... Wait up! Right, that's where jackass is. That's not what we want. Which, again, I cannot believe that's actually his name.
Oh, right. That's right. We're probably not gonna... We still need to look for... <sighs> Students of the Wind Orchestra. Oh, maybe there's someone for the orchestra on here. I would ask Toa, but she's into more, um... Yeah, much different kind of music. You know what's sad? <laughs> You'll understand if you saw the first. That's all I'm gonna say. You'll you'll understand if you saw my playthrough my playthroughs of the first game. Oh yeah, that's right. We we also have to do the um EX orbs too. Yeah, the expansion orbs are also gonna be a uh, thing we have to do for uh, Valmar. Where do you want to go? Because we did get a uh, new system known as the uh, expansion orbs that allows them to like um have like buffs stats and all. Which you to say is very, very useful. Oh, it's been so long since I heard this theme. As guys of the border, keeping all right, watch. The Azure Tree is our duty. And, you know, I do want to kind of, like, you know, check out what can I do for you today? Well, we came to ask you a favor, actually. Oh, I see. Well, if you need a little music, I'd be happy to help. As a career pianist, I can't... I can't think of a better way of a greater honor than helping a whole town with my music. Yeah, once again, I'm doing the, uh, you know, uh, I'm doing the, you know, uh, smart nerd voice for her. You have all thanks. Oh, uh, one thing. Do you have a piano ready for me to play? I'm pretty sure we do.
Oh. No, we don't. Ah! Of course. You're looking for a piano? Uh, now I think about it, uh, there was a rather nice one in the storage. Beside the prison cells in the basement. They must have moved it there after the war broke out. I presume it was brought there by a former commanding officer. Ugh! Haha, <laughs> Fiona was right. We realize this might be asking too much, but... Oh, so that's what you're here for. If that's the case, then we'll have a ship to Celtic for you. Are you sure? I'd hate to make you go out of your way. No worries. Captain Rival gave us orders to provide Celtic with as much support as possible. Thank you. We'll gladly take you up on your offer then. We're quite literally getting the band back together. Where do you want to go? Yeah. Full speed ahead. Again, this is really quite just Oh there you are! How's the preparations going? Hello everything. It's coming along nicely. In fact, we have the same amount of space we did during Chris's concert. That should be plenty of room to stop in. Hell yeah! Is it bugged? Yeah. I'm majorly confuddled. I don't know. Confuddled. I don't know what to do next. Like, it's not. Like, I'm just. Huh. Like, it's not showing. Oh, of course, Elliot. That loser! Alright. Look. Not what I want to do. Where do you want to go? Leave it to me! Yeah, but... Hey, Dama Bang Bang! How you doing? Uh, let's see... I'm, uh, just finishing up, um... Yeah, I'm finishing up, uh, Trolls Cold Steel 2. Or at least getting started on finishing up, because... The final battle is fast approaching, and we gotta prepare real, really quickly. Needless to say. Shame we could get the whole wind orchestra together, but I suppose we'll have to go ahead regardless. Hell yeah! 
I, I've heard a bit about Pe Prince Peach so time, mostly through Newgrounds. Take that for what you will. But yeah, I mostly uh, heard about through looking at images on new grounds. That's all I'm gonna say. There's a piano you mentioned. And you know what? I'm a little curious. I'm a little curious. Maybe I'll watch the VOD uh, later on. Like, normally I get very busy and I can't watch uh, other streamers' VODs very often because. My life is a complete clusterfuck right now, but I don't know. Maybe, maybe I'll actually watch it this time because I'm very curious about the game. Because I don't know, some I've seen. Rayveld, hang on, I'm gonna have a the presses! Riveld! You mean like the Riveld? Like Icy Maiden Claire Riveld? Her family also makes pianos? Is that so? Wait a minute! Hold up! Hold up! Are you saying, Usus? Are you are you saying Shadow the Hedgehog? That Claire Revelt's or rather Claire Revelt's family? Is nobles? What the fuck? Hey, you're right. Fun fact, uh, <laughs> yeah, sure. The quicker the better. Uh, and I'm just gonna spoil this right now, but yes, there is a connection. And yes, uh, Clara Reveld's family is the same noble family that owns the Reveld group. Yep! I know, shocking, because she's like fighting on the reformist side. You would, but I don't know. Yeah, it's, 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 a, it's a little weird. I'd say back to. What the? It's coming from the auditorium. I did mention there would be some sort of event taking place. They properly animated all the. <laughs> hey, it's Yusuf. I mean, uh, hey, it's Elliot. Uh, Elliot Craig doing the one thing that he's good at. Aside from getting killed by literally everything, and that is, of course, playing music and also medic. Like he does do. Uh, he is also a medic, and that's pretty much it. Like, his attacks are garbage, his fortitude and or physical endurance is also garbage, so he, uh, so he gets killed real easily. Which you expect Max to have really high fortitude, like you expect it to be, you know, really tanky. But apparently, uh, not so much with, uh, Elliot. Uh, 
She's not dead! Louise is not dead! Re remember last game where, where I thought she was genuinely dead? Like, like she was killing the attack? She's actually alive! Hell yeah! Ah, uh, major, major sigh of relief right there. And also, whatever lag was going on earlier died down. So that's good. Ah, wonderful. And damn, that music was a banger. Thanks for joining us, sis. Thank you, Instructor Mary and Andre. I didn't think things would have gone as well without you two. <laughs> Glad I could help. It was nice being able to play alongside Elliot for the first time, too. It was an absolutely wonderful experience, boss. Especially considering how many people we had in the audience by the end. Haha! <laughs> That's all the proof I need! Listening to it wasn't gentle. Please blow in my heart. Of course you mentioned the Wens, Gaius. I like to extend my thanks well to give me the opportunity to do something for the uh, good people of Croizen. Oh yeah, because uh, yeah, you see, you see, acting governing lord of Croizen province right now because his father was arrested. So he's the acting duke of Croizen currently. I've always wanted to help repay the people. Aw, hell yeah! Wait, Sister Rosine actually joined the ship? Alright. Let's see, yeah, that's right. Alright. Now we're gonna go search around for some more stews because here's the thing. And really, you know, finishing up, like, today is gonna be, you know, um... Well, first up, we're gonna be going to the other shrines. Uh, well, later, we're gonna be going to the other shrines. Um, and, but before that, we have to gather everyone else up. And that's why we are, of course, you know, uh, going out of our way to complete all the side quests beforehand.
Uh, shop. Because we gotta buy some stuff, so... There we go. All right, we already have that, but... Perfect. Also, let's see, what, what equipment do they have? Also, we need some that prevents faints because... Um... Yeah, that way he can't, uh, he can't be killed, or at least he can't be, uh, knocked out. I mean, he can still be killed pretty easily, though. Well, nah, Pluto, or rather Gaius Warzel, as I, I have to call Pluto as, um, uh, hey, Spillfunk, how you doing? Yeah, Cold Steel 1 isn't the best game. Cold Steel 2, on the other hand, is much better. And by much better, I mean it's absolutely night and day uh, between Cold Steel 1 and 2. Yeah, it's just Cold Steel 1 that's a really, really bad one. That uh, people should avoid. One. One's the bad one. Cold Steel 2, on the other hand, which is what we're playing right now. That's the holy mother of God. That's the tree right there. The tree from which but uh, mind you, um, the Trails to Azure gets its name. Fun fact. Yeah. And I'm actually almost done with the game. With this game, anyway. And it's only been, like, what? Um, like, about, like, eight streams? 
just to demonstrate how much better it is. Stay on your toes. Let's move. Here goes. Overdrive. Here we go. Spirit unification. Oh yeah, Mars Marine. My turn. Burn to ash. Fall. Hell yeah. An opening. Onward. Shatter. True armor breaker. We're doing a lot of damage to this guy. Okay, and then we're gonna want to finish it off with, um... Arcane Gale! Ah! An opening. <laughs> All right. Here we go! What the? That? <laughs> yeah, these characters can be definitely. Leave it to me. Especially because the the voice of the main character, uh, Sean Chiplock. Is also uh, who, by the way, voice Reed, the main guy, the main protagonist, is also a voice of Rivali from uh, Breath of the Wild. Yeah, I know. Shocking. Take this. Thanks. Let's move. Yep. My turn. Yeah. Yeah, that's why it sounds so much like not only Dante for Devil May Cry, but also uh frickin' uh Rivali from uh, Breath of the Wild. <laughs> I love Valmar, by the way. I love him. You know what? Let's go ham. Super big flame dragon! Hell yeah! Barely any damage. Leave it to me. Let's see. You know, we're just gonna do, um, sow the wind, bring the whirlwind. I'll handle it. Yeah. Onward. 
Oh right, she has uh, Jack in the way of arts. My turn. Perfect. Here I go. Too slow. Unforgivable. Oh, damn. Here I go. Let's move. Here goes. Overdrive. Yeah. All right. But yeah, he will be really good. That's okay. Let's see. Um. Let's see, we don't quite have enough, but we do have enough for a Gale Extended. At least. Burn to ash. Fall! Now's our chance. An opening! Onward! Huh. No escape! Hell yeah! Leave it to me! Let's move. And all of his uh and all of his spells or rather arts are attack arts by the way, fun fact. Uh let's see. Leave it to me. Let's see here. Um. Yeah. And maybe reason why I wanted to do this boss to get out of the way is that this one that beat me really, really way back then. And hell yeah! How's that time? Is it like worth uh playing? Like I've heard a bit about it back in like um I wanna say uh Oh what when did I hear about? Like 2019? And after that year I stopped hearing Jack about it. Like, it blew up, got really big for one year, and then just disappeared. <laughs> I go where the wind takes me. What's this? Did that I want what I want what's for! I guess that's an antique. I got sense of unusual force coming from it. Ah, okay. We should definitely try to collect the Lost Arts. Again, today is primarily going to be, um... It's primarily going to be, uh... You know, uh, going around and collecting stuff and actually, you know, getting ready for the final confrontation day.
Well, see who has Jack in the way of, our, of Quartz. His encapsulant levels aren't all that impressive. Uh, he doesn't really have that many. The Countess has enough. We're gonna have to figure it out once we get back to the ship, I guess. Oh, uh, wh what's going on? Is, uh, making out with one of the plushies? Uh, I, I don't know. Oh. Oh, I was gonna be like... Oh, God, are, are you saying that it's, um... You know, to the plushies. But nah, it just has Sean's blanket. Alright. Alright, there's a Terra Shrine, but... Where do you want to go? Alright, what, what's the final quest say? The final main quest. Volceron, Oryx Canyon, Paran Path 3, East Area, okay. Uh Oh wait, that's right. Where I'm do you want to go? Dumbass. Uh let's see, um Aurox Canyon. Nah, that's not right. Croix is in the south. Uh let's see. I love the main thruster animation. I love the main thruster animation for uh, the Courageous when it fires up its big engines. Hey, Class 7, sounds like you've been pretty busy lately. Rex, what are you doing here? Ha <laughs> ha! I've been going around with the Railway Military Police taking photos all across the country. I'm a cameraman by nature. Well, Croix the Provincial Army is tip temporarily drawn for conflict. Not even I can guarantee your safety if you were to anger them. Oh no! Here's why West Virabon is a bad idea. You know why they're not going to the West in this game? You know why they're not going to the West in this game right now? <laughs> yeah, that's because Western Arabonia is absolute hell and is literally unlivable. And, uh, just so much stepping foot there is a guarantee that you're gonna die.
<sighs> Fidelio! Ha ha! So I knew you were okay after all! And yeah, I do reuse some of uh, Olaf Craig's voice. But unlike Olaf Craig's, which sounds like this, uh, Rex's sounds a bit more gruff and, uh, and like, you know, um, sounds a bit more gruff and or raspy. Like, ha ha! So, I certainly am traveling around on the courageous with Class 7 and plenty of other toy students now. I've been taking photography of the war from the perspective of Noble. Really? You've been acting as a war photographer too? We told me you were going on to Western Albania, but you understand how dangerous that is, right? Of course I understand. I know it will be dangerous, especially for... All he did back in the club was take pictures of cute girls. Ah, uh, so he's that kind of person. <laughs> Horn dog. Huh? Yeah, but we're going to be recruiting everyone and having them uh, join us on the Courageous. Because again, uh, so what happened to the ca the, the um, Arabonian Empire, the, uh, yeah, the Imperial Navy's flagship, the Courageous, is simple. Everyone died. Or at least, you know, most of the crew died over the course of the war. So, because most of the crew have been killed by now, we had to replace them with our own guys. Slowly but surely. Ha! We have nothing to fear. I'll handle it. Yeah. My turn. Oh no, we're 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 doing okay against them. Actually, that was way better than it had to be. I can already tell. We're gonna go back and recharge our arts a little bit first. See the Imperial flagship, you know, looking a lot more lively than it was previously. And you know, actually, um, mostly inhabited.
One thing I will say that I do not like as much about this ship, though, is that it's really easy to get lost. Like, incredibly easy. Yeah, we're just gonna recharge here, and then we're gonna go ham on whatever this beast is. Yeah, I do like uh, when it does fire up its main engines, so... I don't know, there's something about that. Alright. Alright, so everyone's healed up, everyone's charged up, we're all ready to go. Ah! Where'd you come from? Stay on your toe. My turn. Eliminating targets. Go. Let's uh Gale extend. Leave this to me. True up cleaver. Does have self healing? Onward! Bring it up! My turn! Hell yeah! All right. Honestly, I don't even think we really need crafts. I'll handle it. 
Oh, we just do a bunch of normal attacks on these guys. My turn. Second form. Hell yeah. Let's keep moving. I'm just getting started. Success. That should suffice. Oh. But yeah, today's stream might be a bit longer than others because, again, we're, we're preparing for everything. Enemy sighted. Let's take him out. Let's move. Second form. Damn. How did you miss twice? What the hell? Holy! Leave this to me. That should have insta killed them. Now's our chance. Got you. It's my turn. Now. You're done. <sighs> Time to take a nap. <laughs> I I love Fee. <laughs> this over with let's move huh. you know what I think we could just take this one down down pat oh okay it's safer now hmm. Not bad. yeah we're gonna have to level up uh hey though it would be a turtle how did I know our big boss tonight would be, or at least the big boss for this canyon battle would be a turtle? Gee, how'd I know? the fact that we, you know, we just fought turtles down there. Perhaps that kind of let me know, but god damn. This one's dangerous. Stay on your toes. Here I go. Ugh. Okay. Okay, this one's gonna be a bit tougher. Let's see. Onward. You know what? Overdrive. Overdrive. Flare bomb, volcanic rain or flare bomb. Yeah. No, let's do flare bomb. Uh, being fire based, it wasn't as effective, obviously, but. You know what? Here we go. Ah! Right yet? Whoa! Hell yeah! All right. Let's see. Or. Oh 
yeah! I wonder, since it's fire based with water based attacks, they actually do quite a bit. I'll it. Oh, jeez. Okay, um. Good luck. I'll show you how it's done. Let's see. Do again. Leave this to me. All right. Here we go. Aja, ultimate strike. Hell yeah. I think that's it. I think that's it for uh for all main quests. Great. No complaints here. Success. That should suffice. I've got it. I spy with my little eye the goods. Uh. But now with that done. And out of the way. Yeah, usually when casting arts, by the way, guys, I do wait for, uh... I do wait for... The zero arts. Because that's, like, the best time to actually do use them. So, yeah. Rock Dash?! The Countess and her big, meaty sword! Our fighting was in perfect sync. When I could keep up, at least. Alright. But yeah, that just about covers everything. So I'm guessing then... Tell me all about what you're <laughs> up to. 
Oh! Damn! That's a lot, Mira. Marvelous. You've ranked up. This is just a little something from me. I knew I could count on you. <laughs> All right, so all the main quests have been taken care of. Now it's just, you know, time to take care of the smaller stuff. Where do you want to go? Like, uh, Mei and Ruer. All right, first of all. Because there is actually something that we do have to take care of in Ruer. And that is not the right place to do it. Alright. I'll handle this. Let's move. Why do I always go up there? I don't know, maybe <laughs> Made the call of Jackass just I don't know. Uh, let's see... Upper level. Really, the Roar Institute of Technology is not... Whatever! It should be hot selectable, though. Yeah, we'll do it. Yeah, that's right, run off. I'm not in a good mood. We're looking for a man named Stefan. Chest looks really nice. Remember when we used to fear the bugs? Now they fear us. Dara is just a VR chat joke, as I explained before. I don't know. We might go back to the uh, to the Croizen Province Highway or the. Uh, yeah, Croy's and I waste some more and look, uh, and try that chest again. Wait up. Hold up! Stop the presses. What's going on down here? Huh? What the?
Leave this to me. I mean, we are. This one is really dangerous. Shatter! Ooh, I'm a breaker! Now's our chance! Got you! It's my turn! Hell yeah! Let's see. Dara! Let's move. Heal you. And second up. to refill uses uh, ink felon very regularly I guess yeah. because he can't auto regenerate ink felon at least some other uh, characters can Alright. 
Oh! Eh? It's supposed to be a zoo one. Ah, oh, that is a zoo one. That's the essay on night. <laughs> this should do extra without his uh, critical. My turn. All right. Uh, Here we go. Probably not the best choice there, but whatever. Now's our chance. An opening. My turn. Attack. Rather is a big healing move. But we need it right now. Leave it to me. All right. Pluto, you're gonna withdraw. You how it's done. Because we need uses for something. Uh, Leave this to me. Drama Braca!
There we go. My turn. Gotta be a critical. We go. You have my face. Thanks. Okay. And honestly, I think we should make with pleasure. Now that's more like it. I love his, uh, his finisher, though. Like, guys, his finisher. Like, all of his finishers are cool. But... Perfect. Alright, <laughs> oh, yeah, my food's here, but... My turn. Yeah, I'll be right back with my food.
All right, I'm back. I know that the likelihood of us actually defeating this is gonna be like very low, next to none even. But it's worth a try, because here's the thing. We need everything we could get in these final boss fights here. Both the true final boss at the end of the main story and the, um... And low Luciferius at the end of the game. Yeah, we both got we got both of the crits My now. Team. All right. No First crit. Now. Let's move. Very well. Arcus, activate! It's my turn. Huh. Feel the power of the Dara! <laughs> Have my 
my face. My turn. Oh yeah. My turn. My turn. You have Thanks. my things. Leave this to me. Oh god damn it, it just ruins that means that Pooh is about to die. Oh Actually, that's perfect. Thank you. My turn. Trauma Breaker! Now's our chance! Got you! My turn! Alright, this should be the last little bit to finish it off. Azure! Ultimate Strike! Oh, Jesus. There we go. Huh, that treasure chest looks really nice. Training to do. Hell yeah! Oh, 
That's a fine looking. <laughs> yeah, that's a truck. <clears throat> That's a trial chest, though, so we're not gonna attempt that. At least at our current health. I don't know. I did make mental note of it, though. And now my encoder's doing the weird scuffy scuff again. Yeah, there's something up with my with my PC's encoder. I don't know what's going on with it, but ever since... Well, it's been really screwed up ever since we tried running Vulcan games on here. Yeah, I guess... I guess Vulcan just screwed up my my GPU even more. Well as if Unreal Engine 5 wasn't bad enough. Which the GPU issues are probably why my game's lagging too. <coughs> yeah, it's probably all tied to the exact same issue, that being my graphics card. That's probably uh, why why my game keeps hitching randomly too. Yeah, the game got real unstable uh, when my uh, GPU started acting up. So yeah, I guess it, I guess it, yeah, it, it has to be related to whatever's going. Yeah, it's related to whatever's going on my graphics card, that's for sure. It's all related somehow. Yeah, whatever's up with my graphics card is also why the game randomly just hitches and just almost freezes on me. It must be the same issue. Like, it must, it must be... Like, we're gonna wait, we're gonna wait for a few minutes to see if Vixen works whatever's in her system out. You know, Vixa just gets whatever's going on through her system. And then we're gonna continue. Alright, I think she finally got whatever it was out of her system now. That was really weird though. I never had my GPU act up quite like that. That's very worrying. Huh? Aren't you, Reen? Oh good, we found you! Really, sorry you had to come all this way looking for me. Oh, damn it.
That means, by the way, we have to call down the most unlikable character in this entire series. Machius Regnans! What's so bad about him, you ask? Everything is bad about him. Like, he's just whiny, he's very... I welcome all challengers. My turn. Like, he's just, uh, just so unlikable. Hell yeah! Right. Actually, so unlikable is a bit of an our statement. He is just locked and loaded. You won't get away. They're off balance. No, guys. Leave it to me. Take that. Leave it to it's me. It's actually incredibly easy to hate, uh, Machius, because here's the thing. Like, ha! now's our chance. An opening. Here I go. Yeah. I'll take that. Okay. It's safe for now. But yeah, um... <sighs> but yeah, uh, Marcus Ragnitz, uh, where do we even begin with him? Like, the big thing with him, the, the big kicker, the big thing that makes him so unlikable as a character is not only is he very whiny and angry, but he's also just like, also just very nasty. Like he's just nasty to everyone. Particular uses. Like, here's why I love Eustace. Like, Eustace is, you know, he's an edgelord, but at the same time, you know, he's very down to earth. Like, he's for noble. No, he's brutally honest, and. But even at his most brutal times, you know, he genuinely cares for his friends. Even trying to go it alone, just to not put anyone in danger. Like... You know, like... You no, know, like, he is super morally virtuous. Like, he is, you know... He's an edgelord with good morality, I guess you could call him. A principled edgelord, even. You know, like, he's just super, like... And plus, a lot of people like Yusus. Like, you know, it's, it's hard not to like him. Like, he's just so nice. Guys, is Lord Pluto. Like, he's a big, helpful, tough guy who loves to have a good time. But... Oh. But... 
Marcus? Marcus Regnitz. Marcus Regnitz is just so unlikable. Oh yeah, that's right, um... I-I always get a little scared, uh, when it does, uh, download spikes, because here's the thing. The last few times it downloaded a Chrome update, it actually crashed my stream. But this time it didn't. Very interesting. But now the GPU's more screwed up than the rest of the PC is a problem. We made out of there with our lives. So it was very much worth it. I guess this is gonna be a real long stream because we gotta upgrade everyone. Because the next few battles, the next few, you know, big battles... ...are gonna be absolute nightmare. Like, I've heard that there's a really big, uh, difficulty spike. I wonder if you could rest down and, like... No, we can't. Let's look through all my potential candidates here. Uh, let's 
see. button you are an idiot Schroinger there we go yeah that's that uh, yeah we we yep I guess we'll have to find out what they do. Cause I sure as hell don't know. All right.
Mavi or Ment. <clears throat> now we're gonna just drop. They had to be much harder. They had to be. Now, main deck. Okay, so there's one more shop we can unlock. Not sure what this shop is, but... I guess we'll find out. One last companion quest, or uh, well, there's a few others we need to do, but where do you want to go? I think there was also one Berea hard. I'll show you something else that's Berea hard. <laughs> I, I had to. I had to. The, the joke was too obvious. Searching the surroundings. Now there's no way she could have gone to a gram.
Also, I just really don't want to go to a gram. I was really glad he came back and killed those, um, those cryptids, because they gave a lot. Wait up. <clears throat> Hi, here you are, Teresa! Oh, I, I was expecting to run into any of you here. I, I take my father to, told you what happened. <laughs> I could be more pitiful. What makes you say that? I got all worked up, arguing with him, and now he wouldn't give me what I wanted. Great. Where is Emily? I don't think she's anywhere in Berea hard, but I'm gonna check. Wait up! Hang on! Eh? Hang on! Ah, huh, okay. So that's why you're helping out the count. Uh oh. Hancock. Sorry. Uh, you should have gone far, though. Like, you shouldn't have gone far. Leave this to me. It's my turn. Let's move. Like, uh, he should be around here somewhere, at least. We don't really want to fight anyone right now. We're, we're looking for... And if we have to kill a few, then so be it. I welcome all 
challengers. My turn. Truck the ash. Onward. All right. Now. You're mine. Excellent. Well. <laughs> Oh, so we have to level up, uh... Machias. Maki ass. Wins. Give us your blessing. This is more Let's like move. it because, God, I hate that guy. Onward. Anyway, so... It's my turn. Gail, stop! It's my turn. Locked and loaded. You won't get away. Here I go. Second form. Damn. Gail! <laughs> Leave this to me. We should keep going. But yeah, as I said, today is going to be a really long stream. Uh, like, really long, because... <clears throat> we have to get the whole gang back together. If we're going to take that monster on, we'll need to be very careful. I just careful. realized, but they literally just replicated the monster placement of the first game. In fact, I think these were just copied and pasted from the first game and then just dialed up in terms of, like, difficulty and intensity? I don't know. All right. Provincial Army Warriors are still not friendly to us. Where do you want to go? Uh. Full speed ahead. We're going to check Twin Dragons for anyone. Interesting how it still has the Croizen logos on it. And yet yeah, it's no longer controlled by uh, the Croizen provincial government. It is no longer, you know, controlled by the, Imper the uh, provincial army. Double because, you know, again, um, Croizen backed out of the Imperial Liberation Front. At least for now. Until, you know... Uh, until people actually, you know... Decide how, you know, uh, approach it. Love the internal design of that. Now's our chance. Let's get him. Let's 
Ryan's move. Ha! Hell yeah! An opening. My turn. We should keep going. You know, there are some theories I have about some of these monsters, so like... Because I don't know, some of them seem a little... Weird, even for like... You know, uh, stuff that, you know... Should appear in a... In a, you know... In a world where, you know, magic is his being and all that. Even though both magic and crazy advanced sci-fi tech are a thing in this world, so... I don't know. Detected two signals down there. God, you can actually cook in this game. And when I actually start playing this, let me check. So about like three weeks ago. I, I've all, it's been only three weeks and I've already finished this game? Or like, almost finished it? That's actually, uh, way quicker than the original. Wait up. I think I just saw something out of the corner of my eye. Oh no, it's just Twin Dragon's Bridge. 
I thought I saw the top of the tree. Let's get going. Let's ride. You know, I think that Sean Chiplock was the best fucking casting decision they made with this game series, period. Like, dear God. Like, his voice fits Reed so perfectly. I remember when I used to fear the birds. Now the birds run in absolute terror of me. I wonder if the jammers around here are interfering with stuff, because here's the thing. In my particular part of, of Pennsylvania, there are a lot of military bases. And a lot of those military bases use high-frequency jammers that disrupt communications in such a horrible way. Um... Like, just dis disrupt surrounding area communications to such a horrible degree that Wi-Fi devices are unusable out here. Or, or at least cellular devices are damn near unusable out here. Uh, so I wonder if that's what's going on. Like, the naval base next door is like disrupting communications and like causing like the Wi-Fi card to, to lose access or or if it really is just my GPU coder. I'm leaning it towards my GPU coder just because like it would also fit the bill for like the weird stutter I have uh, with the game sometimes. So yeah, probably my GPU being screwed up more than anything. Hey, welcome back! Guess you're... If you're here, you're all done! We are! Indeed, this time goes for you! Alright. Why is he mains on? Let's ride. <sighs> Maybe there's like special anti-jammer like... Nah, that, that isn't a real thing. Only in science fiction, unfortunately. I guess I'm going to just have to tough it out until I can move away from these military bases then. That's really stupid, though. What the hell? You know? Oh, 
Also, I don't even think it's the military bases and the jammers. Again, I think my graphics card's really screwed up for some reason. And it's been really screwed up for a while now. Like... It's been really scuff scuffing for a long while now. Like, my graphics card's been really screwed up. Uh, I gotta use it anyway! I don't know, I might need to replace it soon. Hopefully once I have an IRL job, which I hope is damn near soon because... The situation here is getting kind of desperate, ain't it? Like, my GPU is showing signs of failure. Like, it's, it's about to die. Um, like, my uh, bitrate keeps scuff scuffing because my, um, my encoder keeps going out. Um. Now, games are starting to have, like, micro-lag and, like, hitches where they almost crash on me. God, I need... So, yeah, things are getting real bad as far as, you know, uh, computers and stuff and, like, how everything is just falling apart around me. With uh, my PCs and you know how they're doing. <sighs> Which is all more reason I'm doing, you know, a massive. A massive, you know, push to finish this game tonight. Speaking of which. Yeah, this is the same GPU issues that are go- Yeah, this is the same GPU to me during the uh, Gang Over It stream. The exact same damn GPU issues. Exact same ones. So great, I think my graphics card is actually dying. That is fantastic. Well, I can know I've said that multiple times, but now I'm 100% sure because it was having trouble with, uh, it was having all sorts of trouble with, um, with getting over it, and now it's having old man trouble with even this. So, yeah, my GPU's just strip giving up altogether. That is so fantastic. I'm about ready to throw away this PC. Honestly. Mute? Also, finally, uh, finally, an art to make Machias useful. Okay, that was that's a little harsh. Yeah, sun's definitely wrong with my GPU. See that? See how the game hitched back there? Yeah, it's definitely some up with my graphics card, that's for sure. And now you know why I'm doing this grand push Where do you want to go? tonight to finish this game. It's because my computer is dying. Um, just straight up.
Alright, I think it's stable again. And then as soon as I say that, Vixen starts screwing up again because, you know, GPU issues. What? <sighs> At least Elisa Reinford isn't useless like, um, Machias is. Like, it's not even the fact that Machias' attack sucks. It's, um... Also, the fact that he's just, like, he's just so nasty to everyone. Teresa? Huh? Emily? I'm not dreaming, am I? <laughs> no, been a while, huh? How you been? Oh, you know full well the answer to that. What's the name here? Emily. Ah -ha, I'm so happy for them! Likewise. Why is my graphics card crashing again? I might need to reseat my GPU. I might need to reseat my GPU. This is getting ridiculous. I might actually have to reseat my GPU after this stream. For the 500th time! Like, I've had to reseat this uh, stupid 1060 so many times. And it gets old. God, I hate this computer so much. Sorry, I just rage because, like, why can't they just have a good computer? Like, I know full well the answer to that. My budget, you know. But yeah, that's why I have to find get the IRL job situation figured out now. Is because... Is because, as you can see, my computer is not in a good place right now. Like, just so many tech issues with it, just so many issues of it, just sometimes not even starting streams properly. And all because my GPU and its encoder are just screwed up from years of space engineers. I should sue Keen Software House for, for what their game did to my GPU. Nah, just kidding. That, that'd be a waste of time, but sometimes I genuinely do feel like that. Like, what they did to Vixen's GPU, or what Space Engineers did to Vixen's GPU, is just unspeakable. Just awful. Thank you, everyone. Fine, I give in. I'll allow you to board the Imperial flagship, the Courageous.
Aww. Hell yeah! That's nice. Also, another reason I have to is because uh, Windows 10 support ends in October. So I need to get the hell off this computer eventually. So yeah, there's also that add little thing. Alright, now we got, you know... Oh Jesus, the lag. The crunchiness again. Berehard's music. Like, Berehard has the best music of any of the cities. That's just my personal opinion. Alright, well, let's see. La, 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 la. I realize what the little fish like symbols were. Uh, yeah, those are fishy spots. Of which I do not participate in any fishing in this game. Enemy sighted. Let's take them out. Let's move. True Omni Kaba! And the thing is, with Elisa, like, she can pack a punch at times, but for most part, she's more support. Like, she's filled a more stalwart support role. And her, uh, you know... Combat role is kind of not all that... ...was, uh, cracked up to be. Do I flash? Leave this to me. Uh. Blade of light. Go. Right. You're not getting away. Melting rain. Hell yeah. Leave it to me. So the wind. Breathe the whirlwind! Here I go. Let's move. Hey! That's that. Let's keep moving. Here we go. And it hitched again. Yeah, my GP's really screwed up, ain't it? Hopefully it does not die midstream. If it does, I am going to scream. Alright, but we're searching for two things today. We're searching for, um, cryptids. Which don't think there are many. I 
I get so used to thinking that shift will make things go faster. And usually in this game it does, but not with the, um, not the map. Which is another thing about broken and just terrible. The uh, navigation system is, though. I will give this game this. Um, the navigation system here is a lot better than. is way better than it was in the uh, OG games. Or rather, it was in the OG game, because Cold Steel 1... Yeah, we don't speak about Cold Steel 1. You know what? Where do you want to go? Leave it to me. I'm guess the Apple Shrine is like water. Because let's be honest here, this area is pretty moist. Well, wet. Huh. That treasure chest looks really nice. I am really shocked that thing is called a, is considered a rabbit. We're strong enough to take that monster on. Glorious, I, I love this. Yeah, I, I love this. And sorry about the scuff, my GPU is really screwed up right now. I don't know what happened during the vent stream, but whatever happened during the vent stream messed up my GPU and now and now it just doesn't play nicely with certain games. I don't know what's going on there. I think my GPU might be getting too hot. Like, what if... Sorry about all the tech support and, you know, uh, GPU talk, but... My graphics card has been screwing up all stream, and I don't know what's been going on. Nah, it's finally evened out again. Now it's really unstable again. Now it's evened out again. 
What is go- Is it a power issue? Like, did- Like, did the momentary power outage, like, screw up, like, power regulators? Like, the delivery? Like, I think it might be, like, a- It relates to, like, the voltage regulator, like, the power issues. Because that's what screwed up on the GPU, uh, on my GPU, is the voltage regulators are screwed up. So I think that momentary power outage just damaged them, or like, just destabilized them even more. Which is stupid. I hate that. So, what are you playing? Also, I think that some of them aren't even, like, you aren't able to, like, uh, find those particular people until, like, after certain stuff is complete. Because, like, the tent wasn't there, um, and, like, the previous stream we were down there. You know, the tent wasn't, wasn't there. And neither were, you know, Emily and them. So, I don't know. Maybe after interacting with certain people become obvious? I don't know. Weird. Or uh, rather, you know, it'll become like, um, you know, like, interactable. Or they will be like revealed and become like, you know, recruitable. I don't know. I don't know how to put it. Yeah, I think my GPU's done freaking out, finally. That makes things easier, I guess. Leave it to me. My turn. South Croydon Highway. Ah, there it is. Of course. Love how beautiful, um, yeah, there's something wrong with this, wrong with my GPU. Spring's bad memories! Alright, because we did actually have to find it, um, in the original as well. We were down here. You know, I did kind of think about Ouroboros recently. Um, you know, here's one thing that I do notice a lot about them. You know, their plan, or rather, why they've teamed up with Duke Cayenne, you know, like, why did they, is my big question. Like, Whatever it is, there's obviously some shared goal. Between the AI-led death cult and, you know, the Imperial Liberation Front. And whatever it is, it involves that Red Knight we saw. Testarossa, or whatever his name is. There we go. Now it's now my GPU's stabilized. Watch as it completely starts freaking out again because the voltage regulators start doing weird stuff.
holding. At least for now. Hell yeah! Alright, so that's another person down pat. I don't know, we might be able to, like, move over to the uh, actual shrine part early. But yeah, I think that shared goal involves, you know, whatever that Divine Knight is we saw um, in that one cutscene. Definitely involves Reisei Arnor, Cedric Reisei Arnor. But for what end, I wonder? Conquering all of Erebonia? Maybe? Uh, complete destruction of the world? Uh, stretch. You know, a real stretch, but... Possible. Wiping out those who oppose the... The Imperial Liberation Front and or Noble Alliance? I say that's most likely because, you know, that would follow what we've seen thus far. Be honest, not exactly sure. Oh, I could probably fit. We'll try for Alan. We'll try finding Alan. And if we can't find him, then you know what? Screw it. We'll just we'll just move on to the uh, shrine immediately. Yeah, I don't think we'll be able to find him. Tell me. I knew I could count on you. Adios.
Where do you want All to right. go? We already did the one north here. Leave it to me. I just Let's realized, ride. but this is a water shrine. Huh. And you know what water's exact opposite is? Fire! We're of course also gonna need you. Obviously. Pluto and Elisa, I'm taking you. You two this time. I'm gonna go uh, get a drink and then I'll be right back.
So everything's finally stable. Good. <sighs> Once again, guy, I hate this PC. Cannot wait to transfer all my files off of here. Alright, let's resume our exploration of the shrine since we cannot find the one guy. We need to make it our way to the door inside first. <laughs> exactly right, we should be able to use that to access the proving grounds deeper inside. Well, let's get going! To this shrine are this week. I heard that or again we're just really strong. If this is how the base enemies are, then I can't even imagine how the boss is gonna be. Design here. Just wish the enemies were actually, you know, a challenge. The wind is behind us. Let's go. Here I go. Right. Now let's give them a fight chance. Let's just use our base attacks. Leave it to me. Let's be fair. We should keep going. That took no time at all. Tells me that wasn't the true.
enough. Let's move. All right. Ox Ash. Leave this to me. Well, it's a Cleaver. They're off guard. Got you. It's my turn. Go, Sio. They're open. Hell yeah. Let's go way easier than than anyone would expect. No problem. Oh, these guys are so annoying, though. My turn. Ha! Now, an opening. Our fighting was in perfect sync. When I could keep oh, so a lot of people up. Uh, no complaints here. I'm so glad. You know, here's my thoughts on the fighting themes. Because you know, that's something I did want to address for a real long time with this game. A lot of people do not like the main uh, fight theme, the main battle theme. That of course being, you know, um, uh, what's his face? Uh, he did mind. Yeah, he did mind. Well, shall we begin? A lot of people don't Run. like it. You're not getting away. No getting away. Now. Or at least they don't like it as much as the original games, which is my opinion on that. Which is, I, uh, which is anyone who says that is just flat wrong, and that um, he and mine is way better, way better. What the hell? Yeah, absolutely way better than uh than going to Cold Steel. It's my turn. Like I didn't hate going to Cold Steel, but I don't know. It just felt how I put it. Like impressive as always. It just didn't feel intense enough. Whereas this, you know, has intensity to it. Huh? Thank goodness. I did it! Impressive. 
Hell yeah! Oh, Jesus Christ. <laughs> Please take care around that one. I hope I was hearing that right. Here I go. Burn to ash. Fall. I can do this. You're not getting away. There we go. Now. Now, Gaius. Leave it to me. Yeah. Hunt, hunt. Onward. Uh oh. Yeah. Run, Grave. All right. Let's just spam Hunter Wing as much as possible. Gotcha. Let's move. Rock Dash. Right. You're not getting away. Moving right. All right. Sow the wind. Here we go. Bring the whirlwind. They're open. Gotcha. Onward. Huh? Damn. That was actually real powerful. Going. We're strong enough to take that monster on. battles we have fought thus far have been uh, unscathed though which is nice we should keep going I'm just getting started. most of the battles have been unscathed is pretty much half this game though to be honest because again I'm playing on easy because I've learned unless you um 
Unless you, uh, you know, have all the DLC installed, then playing it on normal and above is is impossible. That treasure chest is absolutely beautiful. But now she's a goat. And I'm scratching my head wondering when that happened. I can do this. Now's our chance. Leave it to me. <laughs> I go where the wind takes me. wonder like you know well shall we begin here i go when the shrines were originally built were they always meant to double now. an opening were they always meant to double as trials I can do this. or did somebody else come along and uh, convert them because i know they were originally meant to like you know produce the um Produce the alloy for which the Divine Knights were crafted from. So therefore, uh, since they were originally cre meant to, you know, create them, it wouldn't make much sense for them to be trial zones unless, unless it was like, 
you know, a security system that was installed afterwards. Which would actually make sense when you think about it, because... You know, they were, really wanted to only make sure that, you know, only so many Divine Knights were created. And they didn't want, you know, anyone... Give us your blessing. My turn. ...to have the ability to, you know, just... To uh, hijack them, I guess, to create more. Burn so, what makes sense if it was, you know, they just, uh, you know, set off all the security when they left just to make sure of that? Would well, actually make sense. Savage Bang! Now. Gotcha. Leave this to me. No escape! Zion! No! No problem! Light! Rain upon us! Here I go! Uh, let's see. Oh, that actually did a lot. It's my turn. Uh, let's see. Go, CEO. They're open. Gotcha. Impressive as always, Gaius. <laughs> Not feeling too winded, are you? I'm just getting started. Your blessing. Here I go. Huh. It's absolutely gonna decimate them, isn't it? Oh yeah. My turn. Huh. You still have a lot of training to do. If we're going to take that long. <laughs> We'll need to. This one will take everything we have. No problem. Nah, it probably won't take that much. <sighs> yeah, it won't. Turn. Burn to ash. Fall. Fall. Now. Now, Laura. Leave the Hell yeah. <laughs> Ah! All right. Go, CEO. Hang in there. No problem. Hang in there! Pants! 
What? It's my turn. Is that Blade of Light? Come. We should keep going. So much faster than the turtles. That's actually ridiculous. My turn. No problem. Okay, Nocturne Bell's actually a good one. Plus, it seems very edgy. So... Double! way quicker. Way quicker than what we what we think it would be. Right by here! Look over there! Second crystal is the mirror ore. Which is big as the last! Oh god, what's coming out? Here's a magic knight! This will look more late than yours! I stood! Let's move. Here goes. Overdrive. 
Let's see. No. Uh, we're instead going to use... That big meaty sword was set. What? I can do this. Are you saying it just repaired all that? Dance for me. I'm getting a little annoyed with this guy. Huge angel rings. Tell me that wing Gundam was not at least a little bit. All right. Uh, of you know what inspired a bit. Like there had to be some inspiration there. Let's be honest here. Hell yeah! All right. Fatal Omni Kaba. My turn. We're just going to keep spamming overdrives. Blade of light. Go. Now's our chance. Got you. Here I go. Let's see. All right, let's do this. Leave this to me. Move. Uh, huh. I can 
do this. Uh. Try this. Here I go. All right. There we go. There we go. No problem. Thanks. You have my face. Hang in there. Thank you. Truax. <laughs> I think I know what this is gonna be. Yeah. That looks like I can do this. Here's them, Mirage Arrow. 
My turn. Valimar! Hell yeah. Leave it to me. Go up. Unbeatable. Great. Uh, I'm so glad. Hell yeah. I'm so glad. That was nothing except for the fact that he kept healing. That was a bit of a pain. Yep. My turn. That was perfect. Earth or area? Let's go to the area shrine. I really like how each of the shrines is designed, by the way. That, that is one thing it will comment. Each of the, their designs is really good. All right. Let's see. We still cannot remove Big Meaty Sword Girl, but Pluto had a nice uh, bit of leveling up. But this time we're gonna do. 
Thon or Shadow and um, Milliam. Wait a minute, I just realized I just screwed up! Yeah, you see, there's kind of a reason we took, uh... Uh, Lisa Reinford all the way out here. Alright. Reinford, you're permanently here. I don't know. Which one of you two should I switch out? We're probably gonna need Emma to open the gates, obviously. What happens if we uh, enter it without Emma? Right. Purgatorial Flame summons the fires of hell itself to turn enemies to ash. Yeah, we're getting it. Getting the hell flames. Let's see. For this, you're just gonna get a simple heat wave.
Perfect. Alright, and the winch ride we go. You know, compared to the previous playthrough, I barely made use of my arts. Like, I did use some... A little bit of, uh, arts here and there. But for most part... Just hang on. But for, yeah, it, but for most part, you know, it was just entirely crafts. There. I had to fix something for a minute. Huh, let's see. Seriously? Seriously? I need to go adjust the arts again. We're gonna switch out characters again. All right, we can't replace you, obviously, Emma. We need you. So now we got Pluto in there instead. Those are just cluster weapons. All right. Like that's all she's firing into the air. Together, we're unbeatable. And I think that. Will be useful at some time? I don't know. Maybe we'll use Shadow the Edgehog to, uh, to guess his center. Then switch him out for Gaius, Pluto, Warzel. 
um, when the final boss comes. Maybe that's what we'll do. I don't know. That treasure chest is absolutely beautiful. I love how they don't threaten me. With a good or a bad time. Whoops. <sighs> Hang on here, let's see. Yeah. Get back up there. <sighs> the way this sh this shrine's layout is making my head hurt. Or rather, the way this map is designed, this mini map is designed, is making my head hurt! God damn it. God damn it! Alright. Now's our chance! An opening! My turn. Oh yeah. Onward. Right. My turn. My turn. What the hell? How did you miss? I am so glad they discovered how to do turbo mode on the keyboard. Like, that is actually very useful. <sighs> so, a bit about my plans after this game's over. Well, after this game's over, we might try either Trails of the Sky 1, or... We might go straight on to, I don't know, like, there's several other games I want to try. But maybe Trails of the Sky 1, 
Maybe Y7. Maybe, you know, whatever else happens. Hell, maybe even Final Fantasy um, 7. You know, we're gonna have to wait a little while and, you know, wait till I have the new PC and play a Rebirth. You know, I have several ideas for what, what could, you know, what route we could take. We can even take a Poppy Playtime route. If I want, but I'm probably gonna just stick with Trails of the Sky. To be honest, or Y7. And maybe Poppy Playtime Root will come after. I don't know, we, we have Venge done. That terrible game. Maybe that will replace some. Um, how was it? Maybe that will replace uh, that, that's not my neighbor game. If we're going to take that monster on, we'll need to be very careful. This might actually be a challenge. Good. Very well. Holy shield. Protect us! Here I go. Uh. Second form. Gal! Leave this to me. Truth Cleaver! They're off guard! Got you! I can do this. Sorry, would you mind? With pleasure. Okay. There, that way we didn't have to face down that guy. Not bad. And for good reason. No Radiant Lion. Onward. Very well. Huh. It's my turn. <laughs> Do overdrive together. No, they can't. You're not getting away. Nothing right. Now's our chance. There. My turn. I was gonna be shocked if they could. Okay, it's safer now. Great. That should suffice. Jesus, Reese HP now is actually insane. Very well. I will serve as your opponent. I'll handle this. <laughs> this is it. Gotcha. Let's move. Now! 
What? My turn. Hell yeah! What a waste of our time. Let's go. I feel stronger. My turn. What a waste of our time. Ugh. Bring it on. Let's move. Go up. Burn to ash. Fall. Oh. Very well. Leave this to me. God damn. You still have a lot of training to do. Uh -huh. I'm so good. Let's move. My turn. I can do that. There's a ah, it's actually using wind to control it. That's actually very cool. around this Stay on guard, everyone. watch out this is a tough one let's move oh god go up here we go Aja holds a bench strike of lightning yeah you heard me right I welcome all challengers very well know your place now. Tiger made my turn of literal lightning. Second form. Damn. David Bowie would be proud. Now's our chance. An opening. Right. Here's them. Mirage arrows. Leave this to me. Let's see. God damn it. My turn. That's that. Let's keep moving. <laughs> I that should suffice. No complaints here. Thank you. 
This is gonna be the biggest leveling up that we're gonna witness. Like, everyone's just gonna be like absurdly high levels by the end of this. And I'm getting the hang of how to navigate this we're place to too. Well, shall we begin? I can do this. My turn. Uh. <laughs> Here I go. Leave this to me. I can do this. Let's move. Leave this to me. All right, go with your big meaty sword. My turn. Hell yeah! Here come more. Oh, no. they're coming! And not that way! Yeah, not not in that way. Mind you. Pierce them! Mirage arrow! Now's our chance! There! My turn! Oh dear god. Burn to ash. We're gonna try to kill them with just normal. My turn. They don't fall to normal attacks. Dance for me. Great fight. <laughs> Sorry, I, I just find it ridiculous whenever she turns into an angel. Like, there's just something so over the top and ridiculous about that. That uh, actually works. Like, sometimes these are just so over the top and just crazy. Let's see. I'll handle this. No good place. What a waste of our time. Let's go. I did it. Uh, I'm so glad. I'm so glad. us actually being over leveled for this area I bet we'll be over leveled for like 90% of the game bring it on oh dear god no problem uh let's see
Here we go. Rock Sash? Leave this to me. My turn. Know your place. Know your place. Oh shit. That's actually a lot of Oh. Health is get pretty crazy too. If we're going to take that monster on, we'll need to be very careful. Yes. Well, shall we begin? Ooh. Be gone. God damn. How pathetic. I'm just getting started. Just see if this kill all those? Like. I knew use was strong, but jeez. So yeah, there's quite a few uh, a few games we're gonna be trying. Probably gonna be trying Trails of Gold or uh, Trails of the Sky first after this because uh, either that or we'll just go right to Cold Steel Three. But honestly, with the way my PC is right now, I don't want to go to uh, Cold Steel Three anytime soon. Here we go. Do this. You're not getting away. Away. <laughs> that takes care of them. <laughs> Hell yeah. <laughs> My turn. Let's move. Everyone's gonna be so high level by the end of this game to the point where everything will be terrified of them. Here we are! Ugh! Now that should be off the crystal. We're not done just yet, though! Here it comes! Here it comes! Stay on guard, everyone! Oh, good God, no. My turn. Here goes. Overdrive. Uh, Let's 
All right, well, let's go melee with this. Super, Azra, Ultimate Strike. What? Dear God. Now's our chance. Got you. My turn. All right. Oh yeah. No problem. Witness the fruits of my training. <laughs> Suck the big pity on him. to you with pleasure no. overdrive ho 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 you know what? i think this is the first overdrive we have seen in a while that doesn't include reen no this is the first overdrive in a while that doesn't include reen Oh yeah. No problem. Now. All right. They're open. Elisa, back me up. Uh, of course it could heal. All of them could heal, it seems. No problem. Here we go. Uh, da -da -da. Go, Sio. 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 Go, Sio
go, CEO! God damn it. My turn. Oh yeah. Here we go. Let's move. There. Ha! Leave this to me. Leave it to me. Take this. We're going hard on this guy. that's anime by the way again this game is a whole evolution above the first there's so going. many more ways than one I did it I'm so glad All right, that's three shrines down, one more go. And then, and then it's on to first the liberation of, uh, I believe right after this is the liberation of Thor's military academy? Hey, I'm sorry if I'm rushing through this, it's just, you know, we don't have all day. Yeah, but I think first we go Thor's, and then finally it all culminates in the uh, Carol Imperial Villa. You know, like that's where the main boss fight starts, where the true final boss is um, seen. True final boss, I can't mention his name yet. But I do call him Crimson Death. Which is pseudo... Which I know, still pseudo-spoilery, but... Look, I'm trying not to spoil you guys with the, who the true final boss is. But let's just say he's awesome, and y you're gonna see...
Where do you want to go? The final shrine. Leave it to me. <sighs> All right. Let's get going. Who haven't we taken yet? Let's take these two. Oh yeah, we can't replace uh, her because she has the thing we need. Imperial flagship is going to be... Something. care about these guys. I'll just kill them all once. No problem. We made it out in one piece. That thing's creepy. Bomb spires don't want to mess with us. Oh yeah. It's safe for now. And as for the path. Let's do this.
sure we should be going up against that thing? A worthy adversary. Let's move. An ugly one, that. Second form. Game. Now's our chance. An opening. Right. Oh no. Trust Cleaver! What? Right. Locked and loaded. You won't get away. We'll reload the save. We're gonna reload no this fun. goddamn save. Yeah, here's the thing about the death blow stat. <laughs> I'm so glad. Exactly how it should be. I feel stronger than it. I'm awesome. Here's the thing about the death blow stat. It's very cheaty. Like, yeah, it's useful, but it's also stupidly cheaty. And I don't really understand why it's even a thing. Like... Like, you know, no other game has that. Like, every other game has insta-kill attacks, My but turn. no other game has a... Are you sure we should be going up against that thing? Strong. My turn. There we go. Burn to ash. Fall. Now. An opening. I can do this. Now. Come on. Onward. True, I'm a breaker. They're off guard. Go for it, Green. Leave it to me. Leave this to me. Hang in there, everyone. Thanks. And the only reason we dragged this <laughs> intolerable exactly how it should be. I feel strong. <laughs> Look at me. Excuse for a human being that is Machias down here is because we have to level him up. I don't want him to be here with us. Bring it on. Here I go. But he has to come. Not that way. Chance. An opening. Right. <laughs> Now's our chance. You're mine. Leave this to me. <laughs> Leave this to me. I'm barrier. Break! 
Here I go. Okay, maybe he does have his uses. Now's our chance. An opening. But they're far in, but they're far in between what a bad character he is. Right. Enemy sighted. Let's take him out. Here I go. Also, I just noticed, but Jesus, those trees are huge. Our fighting was in perfect sync. And I can already tell with all the Sepith we got, we're gonna be rich. Right, my turn. Onward! Yeah, the more I see the way the bridges are arranged and stuff, the more I realize that. Yeah, this is definitely some kind of security system. It was never originally meant to be a trial. Now's our chance. Let's move. Burn to ash. Fall. Now's our chance. An opening. No problem. Leave this to me. Huh? We should keep going. Huh? Bring it on. No problem. Turn to flames. Again, his attack is absolute garbage. Now's our chance. Was it worth because uh, my turn? And the thing is that Elisa Reinberg, she's outright meant to be a support character, whereas the thing that makes Machia so bad, the thing that makes Machia so terrible. Is that half the time it just doesn't know? It feels like Take care around no that one. Falcom Take really didn't know what the hell they wanted him to be. Like Bompresto really didn't know what the hell they wanted him to be ah. between an attack character and a, and a support. Like you know, strong. one who's good at fighting and one who's good at supporting. No one had any idea. My turn. There. Dramedy Kaba. Now's our chance. An opening. Unforgivable. Now let's see what this new move does. What? Holy mer god. Holy 
Ui. <laughs> that takes care of them. <laughs> I'm so exactly how it should. You just summon flames from hell. My turn. Onward. And now you go back to you know what? Now's our chance. Let's get him. My turn. All right. Our Sash! Right. Now's our chance. You're mine. Onward. Right. Hell yeah. Oh, this is gonna be confusing. This could get tricky. Look sharp. Stay calm. We can get through this. Let's move. Witness the fruits of my training. All right, let's do this. Almost! It almost it almost is killed. Now! Now, Laura! Leave this to me! Our fighting was in perfect sync. When I could keep up at least. I did it! <laughs> I built exactly how it should <laughs> look at me! That treasure chest is absolutely beautiful. Are you sure we should be going up against that thing? And music here is a vibe. We have nothing to fear. Right. I really wish they just like. I don't know. I like the music here, but I really wish they add, like, you know, an accompanying battle track and then just use the same one. Like, I like he and mine, don't get me wrong. Leave this to me. I love he and mine. Like it is a wonderful theme. Leave this to me. But you won't get away. I can do this. Fire. Let's move. Ah, Sash. Thank you. My god, your aim is terrible. I'll give you a boost. Thanks. Here I go. Why is the evasion style on this guy? Like the, like sometimes this, these guys genuinely dodge things that no other should should be able to dodge, and it's utter BS.
My turn. All right. Truax Dash. Now, an opening. No problem. You're not getting away. No getting away. My turn. Hell yeah. Should keep going. Huh? Then good. That one looks nasty. Try to be careful, everyone. Oh, my God. <laughs> My turn. La 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 da, la la la. I can do this. Fire. Leave this to me. What? Cleaver! Now's our chance. Got you. It's my turn. Break. Let's move. Ma. Truck slash. No problem. Oh, my God. I absolutely hate these guys in particular. That's that. Let's keep moving. I'm so glad. <laughs> Look at me. Right. Right. Here I go. What is Reen level up? My turn. Enemy sighted. Let's take him out. I'm not done yet. Burn to ash. Do this. Uh, let's see. You know what? Full time, right? My turn. Ooh, that's nice. Also, I decided to switch you out with somebody who's not a loser, uh, Marcus. Because it's you who's the reason we're losing most fouls. Yeah, you didn't stand a chance! All right, final shrine. This is it. This is right before what is probably the worst of Divine Knights. The, 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 the Divine Knight to end all Divine Knights.
I might still overcome the power trial. This is the strongest of all Divine Knights. Or rather, Magic Knights, not Divine Knights. What the hell? Eh? Who's doing that? <laughs> Why did you save us? Did what you were I just did you were a likely story. You can't seriously expect us to believe that. Yeah, there's gotta be some other reason. Last time you tried to do us a favor, you abducted Elise and Princess. And Elfie. plus you follow Grandmasters, probably the AI who started the Great Collapse, so Yeah. <sighs> oh What really how did you even know unlike you? As such, far more <sighs> Sounds like you more than you and the L. Oh, I that being the truth. Huh? So this is what a crystal of ancient magical ore looks like. I'll overcome the trial. You know, you could have just let us. What did I just see? It felt like whatever it was, and I presume that shouldn't have been. Just what did you do for us to see that? Think of it as a special treat from me. Ordinarily, only the Ashen Awakener would have been able to. All see right. It. As for what it is, it's a glimpse of the truth. The truth? And that really was a memory from. Draco was the Lionheart, yes, and the woman with him was the Lance Maiden, Leah. During the war, they too had to borrow the strength of the Divine Knight, and they were drawn into a conflict ah. between the fragments of the Great Power. Just like Reen and Crow during this war. Wait, there's no way the War of the. If that had been the case, surely the world would know of it. I've never seen anything like that in any history book I've ever read. Actually. I have heard mention of that from Grand Wait. Wait. Oh, has the, the fragments of the great power are destined to be drawn to one another. Forced to these dark times Wait up. going through have repeated them and every time the truth of what happened dis system. Hold on a moment. Oh, don't system. That. Wait, you aren't suggesting the clan's true. Uh-huh. We shoulder the responsibility. <laughs> The elder knows, of course, but she. But how pitiful is it to have lived for the sake of fulfilling your duty as a witch without knowing what that duty really is? I almost feel sorry for you. I. Don't look away, Emma. There's no need to be afraid. Of yeah. Reed? There's no need to be uh... afraid. I know what it's like to be afraid of accepting new revelations. Yeah. I feel like once I know, life will never be the same again. Exactly. I'm exactly the same way. Maybe that's true. But there's one thing that I can believe in beyond a shadow of a doubt. That my classmates and all the people who've stood by me through everything that we've been through will keep standing by me to the very end and accept me for who I am no matter what. You're absolutely right. Nothing you could learn about yourself would cancel out all the time we've spent together. This is the class that was still cool being friends with someone they knew was an intelligence division spy. So, yeah. Hold your head up high, Emma. Yeah. There's nothing in this world that could stop yeah. you proudly standing at your side until the bitter end. You know, even if she mean. is, even if the Hexaclan is part of, you know, this awful system, 
You know, you're you're still Emma. You're still awesome. We love you. Vita, thanks to you, I finally changed. I enrolled at Thor's to fulfill my duty as a witch. I won't deny, nor will I deny that until that point, I effectively lived to carry out. But that's the past. Now, I want to live a life of my own, together with the classmates I've been fortunate enough to. I'm no longer the person I used oh, to Oh yeah. Be. And if her voice sounds a little uh, similar to Iris Heart right now, yeah, it's because uh, it's Frida Wolf. By the way, fun fact about Emma. Exact same person who plays Iris Heart. Emma. That's the class president we know. <laughs> I'm impressed. You've matured a lot more than I was expecting during your time at the academy. Avita? But let's put that to the test. I haven't had the opportunity to train to see what Oh boy, why are you Dance. Dance, my sweet little bird. What the hell is she doing? What in God What is that thing? It's called I'd imagine she <laughs> show me if you please everyone lend me your power you've got it leave it to us Oh that one looks tough this will be fun I've got it Of course Break stars in the heavens above What's going on? What's going on? Holy, that, that's actually real quest craft. All right. So what do you want to do? Actually, first I know what to do. All right. Fall! Go. Ultimate Orbital Cannon! It's my turn. 
Probably Taba. Now, I'll back you up. Great stars in the heavens above. Answer to my voice and heed my call. Here we go. I just love this attack, like. It's actually really insane. Thanks for the free and Kaplan. I hate this cheaty, like, here's the only thing. Yes, sir. Like, I don't know, I just hate self-regeneration as like a trope. Like, I just feel it's crazy yes, overused. It's my turn. Maybe, and though for certain I am not the only one who feels this way. Like, I guess thing, all the enemies from Ouroboros, aka, you know, evil AI cult led by the dude who started the Great Collapse. Or evil death cult led by, you know, evil AI. They're really overpowered. Way too overpowered, in fact. You can't miss that bad, can you? Actually, you can. My turn. Huh. 
the hell was that? Let's keep going. I'm so glad. Mm. No. <laughs> Look at me go! Huh? Thank good. Exactly how it... <sighs> it felt as though we did at least. Impre I'm surprised you don't... I go. I go attempt that again. I'm attempting that again. Oh yeah.
Do what? Let's move. We're gonna soften up the bird. Move. One thing I will say about Ouroboros is Jesus Christ, the sheer amount of this. Yeah. Cruelty from them. Oh yeah! Ultimate strike! Here I go! Here I go! Overdrive! Here's our chance! 
Got you! Here I go! Burn to ash! Fall! Now's our chance! Emma! Alright! It's my turn! Do this. You have my thanks. Let's move. My mouth's Over. being silly again. Oh yeah, that's right, she has nine lives, so she could just come back. Here we go. Right yet? Ah! Here we go. None of my tactics are working! It's mainly because, you see, I, I have a tendency to get cocky and overconfident and, and just always just jump the gun, you know? Always jump the gun, always try to use the big guns, always try to use the big moves instantly. Like, that's my major character flaw, is that I just 
always just rush. You know, like I just never. <laughs> Thank you very much. Of course. Arthur's activate. Right. Why are all Ouroboros units so stupidly overpowered? Like... Like, every time I had Tuffy, every time I had Trouble, it was an Ouroboros unit. I leave this to you. Why is that? Like, why are they so overpowered? Oh yeah. Here I go. But yeah. Go for it. Or Boris and Gerald need nerfing. My like, Jesus. A good old nerfing is in order. My turn. You know what, I'll more accept it. Great. I feel stronger. <laughs> <I'm> <laughs> Look at me. Uh, I'm so uh, it Actually, you know what? No, I won't accept it. I'm gonna try this again. Like every time I had trouble, it was it was with Ouroboros. It was with an Ouroboros unit because Ouroboros must always get larger than life. Like Ouroboros has a larger than life issue on literally all of their units. Um, how they are just not thinking tactical enough. Like, because, you know, my big issue is that I always think, you know, guns a blazing, just blam blam, you know? Like, just, just don't think tactics, just think brute force. So, like, that's my issue. And, you know, that's a character flaw that I've had for a real long time. Oh, that just, you know, just try to storm and just use brute force all the time. Here I go. Huh. Let's see. Let's 
great start. Let's move. Oh, let's see. And also, yeah, Ouroboros is still an evil death cult, led by, led by an evil AI, but that's the side point. My turn. Bright wave attack is a little stupid, though. Not gonna lie, like that is just major, just OP bullshit. All right, here we go. Here I go. Here I go. Overdrive. All right. Flame Dragon. Burn to ash. Fall. Now. I'll back you up. Of course. Oh, Moon, shield us from harm. Thank you very Hell much. yeah! All right. Here I go. Now we don't have to worry about. Yeah, except after. You see, that's the that's the thing that trips me up about summoning Valmar is that you can't summon him. Here I go. But the big shady thing about that is that you lose those benefits. So words, it actually becomes really bad in the end, and it just becomes. Uh, Let's move. Let's see. Disactivate. Huh. Thanks. Huh. Onward. You know what? Let's see. Yeah, everyone should have been uh, protected by that.
Yeah. All right. First up, we're gonna remove uh, Let's move. the petrification because he always get petrified. Yeah. Real easy. Yeah, he always gets real easily petrified. Don't know why. Let's see. Oh moon, shield us from harm. Crescent shout. As for you, Elisa, uh, good luck. Wait a minute, wrong button. Once again, I have to fight with this mouse. To do the most basic things. And it's annoying.
Rock Sash Now's our chance. I'll back you up. I can do this. Sorry, would you mind? Come on, Lammy. Here goes. Leave this to me. Oh yeah. Here I go. Oh boy. We're gonna be fighting this bird for a real long time. Let's see, uh... Yeah! Here I go! Oh, Moon! There we go. Time to uh, snipe a giant bird from space. Yes, I really said that. And best of all, no one died this time. Leave this to me. All right. 
Here we go! Hell yeah! This time we aced it! Hell yeah. Or, you know, we aced it for as much as we can. You still have a lot of training to do. And no one died! Great! I'm so glad! <laughs> I've only- I'm awesome! I'm so glad! Exactly how it- Ugh, Did we def- It felt as though we did at least. Yeah, we, uh, we actually did defeat it. Up there! I'm surprised Grianos can even fly after that. You don't plan to keep on- <sighs> No, I think that will do for today. Poor Grianos needs a re- Beta. Well, Emma, you've demonstrated the strength of your resolve. Still, I don't think you need me to remind you. That resolve only get Yes, I know. I'll find a path through life on my own. And I will stop you. Well, here's the thing. About... You know, Emma, like, sure, she comes from, you know, a background of witches who, you know, does, is maintaining an inherently malevolent system that oh should have been ended long ago. But at the same time, but at the same time, you gotta look at it from this way. She's still better than Ouroboros, am I right? Like, they're still are by and large better than Ouroboros. Like Ouroboros is a literal death cult. Led by uh, an evil AI that possibly was the same AI that, you know, ended the world and caused a great collapse all those years ago. Emma. <laughs> oh, I can't see you succeeding in that regard, but feel free to try. I'll leave the last of the treasures in your hands. See you again soon at the Infernal Right. Yeah, what's this infernal right supposed to be? I'm not reading this because I just want to get back to the ship.
But at least this game isn't nonsensically hard, like, you know. Alright, looks like you got the ore. Pretty hefty amount. This should be enough to make a top-rate Tachi for Valmar. Really? Well, it's time I'll be able to finally be Crow on equal terms. All right. Wonder who's sending me messages on uh, Discord. But yeah, as it's saying, um, you know, like, I wonder. Alright, let's go to, um... Roar. We're gonna screw it. We're we're doing it. I don't know, should I stream for a little while longer? I mean, we, um... There we go. That way we don't have to go through the evil burr again. Let me check the, the quests. Because are there any more to? I mean, it's getting towards the end game. Plus, we also need a higher, you know. Yeah, I know. Alright then, I guess we'll just... I 
I'll be happy to, right now? Sure I am, thanks, Reen. But both of us here, the work will be done, no time flat. I think I like this voice better for, uh, George. You can't compare the facilities of the Institute, but... Ha! Ah, okay. And then killing a bird. Hey, the George seems to work real well, Garrett, don't they? Uh, well, if I recall, they were most master of students. He's got those dashing looks, but his personality leaves a lot to be desired. Doesn't take much to impress you, does it? Yeah, she's a horn dog. It doesn't take much to impress her at all. Oh, God. What now? Sure, yes, absolutely. Several days ago, the Alliance moved their line of defense around the capital westward, which means that the east side of the capital, and in particular, the that could totally work. Lucky? Yeah. It sounds like we might fi We finally have a chance to wrestle the account. I guess the Alliance is so focused on trying to defend Heimdall, they don't have time to worry about Trista. We couldn't have asked for a better chance than this. I have some other news that may be of interest to uh -oh. you. The Noble Alliance forces are no longer the ones supervising Thor's uh -huh. academy. Instead, they've assigned that task. Why the upper class? I imagine they were chosen so the academy would... I'm sure they're up to the task. Are we talking about all of the upper class students or just a select number of them? The academy is being overseen by a group of students calling uh -oh. themselves the Alliance. The group is centered around high-ranking nobles, and its commander is one of the sons of Marquis High Arms, Patrick T. High Arms. Oh, God damn it! Patrick? I'd heard that he was still at the Academy, but just what is he doing? And what's this Order of the Lion? Order of the Lion is a group loyal to the Noble Alliance. <laughs> I know nobles love tradition, but that name. Other key member, to my knowledge, the principal and the other instructors remain imp. Ferris is taking. If I had to wager a guess, the Alliance ordered them to. Not like they're in a position to refuse. That's a little worrying. Principal Van Dyke is an honorary general of the army as well, so naturally, the army is concerned for his well being. As such, we of the RMP are prepared. It will be carried out before the battle for Heimdall can begin, using our most elite units. Oh. But that means... Captain, would you consider postponing your operation for at least a few days? Green. Do you not think the RMP is up to the task? No, I think we can liberate ourselves is the problem. I don't doubt for a moment that you are. Since the day we were entrusted with the courageous, no, even before that, liberating the academy has been our exactly. It's been up to us. We went there. We're gonna go there and liberate it again, or right, we're gonna be liberating it. Seven stream either. It's something that every single student gathered on this ship wants to be exactly. A part of. Whether someone else could handle it isn't the issue. It's what we've come this far for. We want. Thank you, Lee. 
I feel the same way as Reen does. Thor's was established by one of my ancestors, so I feel a connection to it in that sense. It feels only right that those who have an attachment to the Academy should come together to take it back. And it's nice that they're playing the original main theme. Even though, again, that game was terrible. We've come all this way believing it would lead us back to the Academy. After exactly! All happened, I think we're the ones... Yep, it's gotta be us. We've all put an enormous amount of effort into make... <laughs> way are none of the actual warriors tasks, left on the on ship? Through to the end. I, I just like realized that. That's a lot of yes votes. <laughs> yeah, I want... Really, Milliam? So, Captain, won't you leave taking... We realize we're asking a lot. But this is genuinely important to us. When I finally see Dad again, I want to be able to look back and... I was never raised to beg, but in this case, no price is too great. I wasn't expecting to get quite so strong a reaction from you. It's almost like we went to different schools. I've never felt quite the devotion and attachment to the cat, so... <laughs> but strange in a good way. Is that a yes? We'll wait two days. Yeah, because you went to some screwed up uh, train system where you um to take Heimdall. It needs to be liberated as soon as possible. I hope that will be enough time for you to achieve your dream of taking it back. Yeah, uh, <gasps> let's say the Iron Bloods went through some really, really mess up stuff. Thank you, Captain. You put on quite a show for someone who was gonna say yes all along. <laughs> and what makes you say that? Regardless, I will be praying for your success. I look forward to seeing you. Fr Good luck to you too, Cap. will begin today at 1200 hours make sure you've done everything you need to do as you already know i won't be taking part in this one my job as your teacher is to stay here and wish you luck i know you can do it thank you we've still got some time until then so it might be worth yeah we can't be too incidentally how comes the development of Valum the prototype was finished last night there's still some work left before it's completely personally i'd say the prog Perfect. i guess but it could lighten up a little I went to go play down in his workshop and he was- Were you expecting to be welcomed with a hug and some candy? Ha <laughs> Poor Milliam. Anyway, by the sound of it, he's She's going to keep finding ways to improve it until the very last minute. I'm going to be swamped with helping him out, but I should- We just might take you up on that. Whatever ensures you're as ready as possible. So much- Right. I don't know.
There we go! Let's see. Ash and Blade. Ash and... Boy, what the... <laughs> what am I even saying? Uh... Yeah, I think that's good. Again, we all know who we're going with, so... Which team are we getting? We're gonna take you, you, because you got that really powerful art. And this is it.
Huh. Emma. Here we go! This is it. This is it. I can't believe we're actually doing this tonight. After this, this means that we only have like three more streams to go. Because, well, okay, four more. Because the next two after this will be um, all the stuff that goes on in the final battle. The main story final battle, okay, you know, true final boss. What the hell? I expected they come. Right. What the hell? Actually, mass produce them. So that's the mass production version of the Goliath Noah. This should be that bad. That was cool. Again. You know what? It's one thing that they could have really had more of. Ally Max helping us out. We're doing quite a bit to the Noah. Here I go. We're gonna have to split among two units here, so you attack the second. Woo! We're actually doing. So far, so good. Hell yeah!
Let's see. Okay, that Kestrel is really getting on my nerves. Yeah, Kestrels are really annoying to deal with. God, I hate them. Okay. Yeah, what makes the Imperial, what makes the uh, Kestrel so annoying is that it was made to be unhittable. Hell yeah! Here we go! Huh? All right, here's the big finisher. Moonlight Blade! They ran off that easily? Really? Like, come on, I thought the Imperial Liberation Front was at least, you know, somewhat less cowardly than this. We're back. <sighs> yeah, I don't think I've ever seen... God, my PTSD memories of the first game here. <laughs> but it's a shame Sharon and Crow aren't... W Still, almost there now. Now, on to the Academy. Not much farther to go. Ah, should've... Mict. Glad to see you're alive. Hell yeah, it's Mict. Kicking. I guess it's good to see you kids back here too. You'll be glad to know that the townsfolk are the same as ever in spite of all this. I do not know who Mict, who voices Mict. Hey, it's class. <laughs> you're all back. Did did someone just say class? My God, the locals! It ain't Toa too. <laughs> oh boy, feelings mutual. It, it really is. When the battle began, 
We all started taking shelter, but when we saw the Alliance guys running off with their tails between their legs, we came out here hoping for some good news. I can't believe you guys actually made it back here. <laughs> Looks like Mict was right after all, right? Right about what? Yeah. I heard from Toby, uh, Toval, that you guys would be here to liberate Tristus. He, uh, told me. Really? I guess he must have heard that from Captain Claire or something. Still, since you're here, I take it you're planning on taking back the Academy? Good on ya. Show us all some real Thor spirit. You know we... Thank you all so much. All right, everyone. All right. right! Hell yeah, all right. So, time to take back the Academy, of course. Lucky to have everyone's support. <laughs> they totally. <laughs> and that's all thanks to you and Toa. You're both always helping everybody out around here. <laughs> you should be proud of yourself. All right, let's go. Well, here we are, a place where we... <laughs> Same. It's weird. Yeah. It's still the place where our class We're going to We've been waiting for you, Class 7. Oh, boy. Hi, it's Patrick Iarms. It's been some time, sure. I haven't the faintest doubt that you and your classmates would have been here. Nevertheless, you have our congratulations. Oh, hello, Celestine. <laughs> I'm pleased to see that you have it. Ah, yes. Uh, Ferris. Um, to explain who Patrick, uh, Ferris, and all Ferris? those others are there. Yeah, it's a shame Loggins and Alan aren't with you. Fair nobles. Still, looks like that's all you need to know about them. Of a challenge to keep me interested. Except that Patrick High Arms is uh is also the uh, Marquis High Arms. I'm honored, the strongest swordsman of the Sarwood well, province. You look ready for Although, judging by what you said earlier, you must have predicted we were probably before the battle. Who do you take? We know you. There was absolute naturally we took precautions on. Huh? Right. Everything's going as but keep in mind there's no. <laughs> Oh, come on! And I see you burst in. Welcome, Cl uh, Oh, great. It's you. <laughs> well, you're one of the. Guess our attempt to sneak in was a total bust. So it appeared. <laughs> you are. I see quite a few familiar faces here. <laughs> what a joy it is to see you again, Yusuf. Adol? You look well, Fee. <laughs> I'm sure the flag Oh yeah, and Ale's also a noble. Uh pretty much everyone in the white uniforms are nobles. Man, this isn't gonna be as easy as I was hoping it would be. Like that's the one word to describe them all. Nobles. That's all you need to know. 
Master Patrick, the battle should be in full swing of... Then shall we begin... Set on fighting us? <laughs> we are the ones entrusted with the uh, order is the, the bow. We're all students here. We aren't doing this because we were ordered. We're doing this because we're upper class students. Neither the will of the alliance nor my we are noble. We wished and we You thought long and hard about Sorry. We're going to take it fighting you. We believe that's why we Sell us as you wish. Now. A four way. What? When did you start? You. I've been waiting for the day where we can. I will. Sh of course. I don't believe we've had a chance to fight seriously since Mishy panicked. Oh, yeah. Friedel's is, um. Yeah. Friedel's, uh, swordsman style, uh, is just. Normal Vandercore fencing. High Arms is the one that used Zardzade, Heavy Strong, Vandercore fencing combined. So he's gonna be a real pain to take we down. We have our. Let's see. Bring it on. Ha! Let's. Here goes. No matter who's. Time to go full throttle. Time to shine. All right. How about this? <laughs> You're off balance. You're done. Okay. So, these are the people that the that the oh, Imperial Liberation goodness. Front has left in charge of Thor's military academy while we were gone, huh? I expected a lot more. Not gonna lie. <laughs> oh, hell yeah. Okay. Yeah, we're definitely okay. Now, let's see, uh... Let's see what it does to humans. Your new uh, ultimate attack. Okay, that's a little morbid to say, but uh, it, you know, it's kind of the point. Holy! Dude, one of them is already frozen. They're starting to heal each other. Dragon Kick! Hell yeah! Angelica Roger is just so powerful. And <laughs> there she is doing the Naruto Clone Jitsu!
Seriously, I sometimes wonder if B's entire thing was inspired by, uh, by Naruto. To a very high degree. And you don't understand why. All right, let's see. This uh. activate. I can do this. Bow girl to bow girl. Master Patrick. We did it. We did it. Yeah. <laughs> we sure did. Looks like we're the victors this time. I can't believe it. It's been for... Why? I fought with all I had. Why was I not victorious? This can't be happening. First I lost during that practical exam. And now I've lost again? Master Patrick, please raise it your head. Uh, I expected these boss fights to be way harder. We may have been bested. Defeat shouldn't always be. Damn it! <laughs> I can't even. I couldn't be more proud to call you my friend. Do you mean that, Elisa? Uh, how does one even uh, respond to such a thing? It was an honor to fight. Your skill was the same to you. I you thought, thought this boss fight would be way so harder. From this duel will. Something smells a little off. Principal Van Dyke! He's okay! Principal Van Dyke has tried to mack her off! I thought you were all locked up! No, I'm okay, comrade. Principal Van Dyke. I will always pronounce it Van Dyke, no matter what. Good to see you kids again. What well, we did, why well, as we were asked to witness a battle from the inside, what a fine battle it was. Yep. <sighs> Wait, Patrick. Correct. As soon as the Alliance withdrew, they were merely asked to remain in. Wow. <laughs> we played our part by watching the. That was Angie! Oh, Beatrix! Hell yeah! Principal Heinrich too. <laughs> no broken bones, I hope. 
No! And we saw Toa's totally awesome to ultimate attack. These two had been keeping an eye on us this whole time. My blade was utterly useless. Mast one would be a fool to say otherwise. Oh! There's no need to be so blunt, Sarifa. Why? Yeah. In name do I have to what? Yeah! Yeah! Yo, game! Nice work, guys. <sighs> Master Patrick. What is the meaning of this, Schwarzer? Did you not learn your lesson from the last time you tried to hold your hand out to me after battle? I don't think you can compare this to the battle. Yeah. Sure, we fought before, and it's the first time we did so while regarding one another. Maybe you couldn't take my hand after that. Hell yeah. <sighs> exactly! You know, never this is a different bow. Yeah, this spell's way different. In a good way. I hereby proclaim the or all upper class students will assemble under the lead. Hell yeah. All students, regardless of class. Yes! Thank you, Patrick. <sighs> Thank God the school is no longer under... Well, that was quick. Yeah, very quick. Like... I honestly wanted this to be a little, a little longer. I'll have none of that from you. <laughs> we finally made it. We just got so strong. What we set out to do. We really have. But yeah, the boss fight for this was a little lacking. All of us. Like all of us was just the high arms boss fight. And that's it. That's it. That's all you have to do to defeat the Imperial Liberation Front. Controlling this, uh, controlling Trista was, you know. Just kill the two guys in the max, then fight Patrick K. Arms and win. That's it. That that's all you have to do. It feels so good to know that Thor's can finally. That's right. But this isn't over yet. Our lives in Trista were simple but full of happiness. We've taken back our home, and now it's time we take back our. Right. It was a long and difficult journey, but we were finally able to take back the academy we had longed to return to. And where are we Cheers gonna land the airship? Continued well into the night. With every because us, there's no airport here. Feeling an overwhelming sense of pride to be a so are they just gonna squeeze the flagship into the? What's more. Proving grounds like they did the last future. time? So long as we were united, we had the will to work towards putting things right at last. Indeed. But no, seriously, how, how are they going to land the airship? <sighs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Upper rank you go. Here's a bonus from the academy. Wow, that must have been tough. Oh, okay. 
That should have gone way higher! So we didn't get everyone back on the ship like we wanted to. So what? It, it still worked out all, you know. All's well then as well, I guess, is all I'm gonna say. Everyone's enjoying the Divine Night. That's ha that's awesome. They actually squeezed it in. I'm so happy. Maybe it won't last, but everyone's to. After all, who knows what tomorrow will bring? I knew things wouldn't instantly go back to normal, but I didn't expect all that to be thrown on us. Yep. Huh. You know, one thing I do want to say about the Imperial flagship. At least it can mostly dock on, um... You want us to help liberate the capital? With Ruhr and Berea hearts, if we don't seize the moment before the year is up, there's every chance the war will drag on even longer as a result. The fighting is still brutal as ever in Western Erebonia. Oh my god. It wants to do what? The Nortia and Kreutzen provincial armies keep their word not to interfere. <laughs> that does sound like the best chance we'll ever get, but I still have doubts. I've said it before, and I'll say it again. We have no intention of taking Yeah, exactly. Well, we were just about liberating Thor's military academy and just helping out. We're not... We simply wish to fulfill our duties as mil... That sounds perfectly f We aren't asking you to fight on the front lines to retake the city. Right. Yeah? And where might that be? I'll be the one explaining that. You're from the intelligence division. Yeah, that's that's Scarecrow. Huh. Hi, Elector. Long time no see. Yep, the most pressing problem over there is all taken care of now. So, I was finally able to access the Intelligence Division's network again. Wait a second. Most pressing problem? What happened over there? Uh, yeah, what did oh, happen? You know, that Azure tree is gone. There was a ton of confusion after its disappearance. But President Kreuss has been arrested, and things are beginning to calm down. 
We had no idea. I remember feeling an incredible amount of mana from that tree. Whatever happened there, it's obvious Ouroboros was involved. Regardless of how it came to happen, the fact remains. Crossbell is of no danger to us now. Yet with that comes new dangers on the horizon. Yeah, exactly. What do you mean, Dad? Now that Crossbell is no longer a threat, there's every chance the Calvert Republic might... The Republic still has its own share of chaos as a result of their economic crisis and terror. But now that there's an opening to take Crossbell, we've no doubt they will recover sooner rather than later. And without Gorelia Fortress to serve as an effective deterrent, there's always the possibility they could use Crossbell oh. as a stage to launch a military oh. into Erebon. As a result, our primary concern is ending this war as soon as possible. And we could use your... I understand the situation. In that case, where is this? That would be the Corel Imperial Villa. Hey, isn't that? That's the Imperial family's villa on the outskirts. Are you suggesting that my family is at the? Ah, okay. Believe your assumption to be correct, Your Highness. The intelligence division has a staff. Lady Elise Schwartz. <gasps> Dad, they've been there this whole time. It's close to the capital, but it's surrounded on all sides by cliffs and the like. That makes it the perfect place to keep VIPs hidden away. Exactly. The only way to access it via land is a special train that runs from Heimdall Station. And that is currently hep. However, were your party to use the Courageous to fly there, you should be able to... Of course. I think you already know our answer. Yeah, I'm in. If you say they're there, Lecter, then they're there. It's not much different from liberating the yeah. Twin Dragon's Bridge. Indeed. While the Imperial family is naturally of great importance, rescuing a member of the board of directors fits... And we've always seen it as our... Guess that settles that. Uh, thank you. I truly appreciate it. Uh, well, aren't we being humble? Yeah. <laughs> this is what friends do. And above all else, uh, rescuing Reed's sister because she's being forced to be a maid there against her will by the ILF. To think these kids would turn out to be so dependable. You're telling me. They're almost dazzling. <laughs> your Highness, may we have your... Yes, by all means. I say, Arner, humbly request that you carry out this mission. Very well, your highness. Students of Thor's Military Academy, I hereby declare that we shall dedicate our all to the liberation of the Corral Imperial Villa. Really is strange. For all I know, tomorrow could determine the outcome of this war. And yet I feel complete just being back here, seeing this. Why? You're not planning on standing here. Oh, hey, so. Oh, it's the cat! Oh, yeah, that's so, Celine. Who knows? I'm guessing she's. One of the second years dragged her off. Something about checking if any of her precious. <laughs> I don't know. I could wander. It's like it's suddenly registering just how much this. I knew I liked it, but I never really. Oh, well, whatever you end up doing tonight, make it count. With both Vita and Ouroboros involved, you haven't seen the worst this war had. And you don't want to face your friend in the goofy bandana weighed down by regrets, do you? True enough. Oh, hey, are you here because you've always been. Huh? This could be the last night you have to enjoy before everything goes to hell. Go and walk around. Oh, and go pay Val. <gasps> Honestly, anyone with half a. I suppose she's right. Besides, it's I've got a lot of. And I
And this is gonna turn into another uh, school day. The lighting is kind of weird. Also, Jesus. But, uh, I don't know. The design's good overall. So not gonna hate on it too much. the thing here's here's the big thing here you get like look I could stay up all night and you know actually finish the game but the big thing here the big the big thing would be um, YouTube limits you see, uh, yeah, I would hit the 12 hour limit if I did that. So, unfortunately, we're probably gonna just call it here for a night and then just, uh, I don't know, pick back up uh, tomorrow. Nah, not tomorrow. Tomorrow's Gartic Phone. So, uh, then. I don't know. Yeah, yeah, tomorrow's Gartic Phone. So, yeah, not tomorrow, obviously. And what the hell was that with my monitor? Uh, but... I don't know, sometimes next week, I guess. So, uh, that's pretty much it for the stream. Uh, oh boy. That's it. This is it, everyone. The end game has officially begun. And... <laughs> I'm actually excited! This time. Like, last time, I was dreading it, because... Oh my god. Oh my god, Cold Steel 1 was terrible. But no, this game, I... I'm enjoying it all the way to the end. Like, I am actually excited for the end game here. Uh, can't I wait for it to pick up tomorrow. Um, or, or rather, cannot wake up to, cannot speak today, cannot wait for it to pick up next week, uh, probably on Monday, probably on Monday is when we're gonna be hitting it real hard again, but yeah, uh, needless to say, uh, we got a lot done, we, uh, managed to, uh, clear out all the str shrines, um, Including one where we had to fight the giant bird of Vita Clotilde. That bird was a lot harder than they thought it would be. We also managed to uh, get, you know, to get everyone on the ship. Including, uh, including Elise after we set up a few, you know, uh, radar antennae for her. Or at least, you know, relays for her. And, um, Colette. After we helped out with uh, making jewelry. And as soon as that happened, after that happened, we, of course, you know, went to, uh, finally, uh, went to finally, uh, liberate Trista Kami, which was, you know, the final big, uh, the final big thing, and also the final big stepping stone for, you know, um, for, you know, getting all the way to, uh, to the capital, where we'll be, uh, you know, trying to liberate next time. 
But it also, and not only did it, you know, serve as a, you know, as our main goal, you know, liberating the academy as our first main goal, but it also served as a test bed for the giant, uh, for the giant Tachi we made, uh, Valmar. You would say, it performed way better than we expected, for sure. Uh, also, on top of that, um, on top of that, uh, I'm gonna be honest, I was a little bit underwhelmed with the Marquee High Arms boss fight. Like, I expected, you know, it just not to be his boss fight. I expected to, you know, like, have multiple phases and running through facilities and, you know, beating up bad guys, but no. All, all you had to do was just enter the enter the school, fight Marquee High Arms in the boss fight, uh, kill those two guards outside in the max, including, you know, the, uh, the uh, Goliath Noah, and that's it. Boom. It was a done deal. Yeah, really underwhelming. I, I thought they would I, I thought they would have way more. But hey, at least the at least the theme music was, you know, cool for it. But yeah. Uh yeah, the end game has officially started and um yeah. Um up next is on to the liberation of Heimdall, I guess. Which uh yeah, I needless to say, that's going to be very uh, difficult because, um, well, I should say a lot of stuff goes down, and it does not go according to play at all, in the best way possible. So, what will we be doing tomorrow? Uh, Gartic Phone. That's all I'm going to say. Gartic Phone. Uh, that is literally what we're going to be doing tomorrow, is just, you know, uh, play more Gartic Phone. Uh, probably, um, we're probably gonna have Sarah on there. Uh, I know they, they've been busy with, uh, Princess Peach Showtime? I, I don't know jack about that game. Uh, I'm gonna watch a few VODs on their channel to get a good idea of what it is afterwards. But, you know, uh, other than that, I... I don't know. I have no idea what what that game is at all. So I guess we'll I guess we'll find out. I guess we'll find find out as I watch it. Needless to say, I can't of course stream it, but you know because my switch is dead. But you know, uh, sorry, I I was getting a little sidetracked. But yeah, um. Tomorrow will be Guard to Phone. And next week, next week will primarily be uh, focusing on the same stuff as this, as today. In other words, you know, finishing up this game, getting it out of the way, and, you know, uh, finishing up any other games that I could foreseeably finish up in the near future. Um, oops, sorry. Uh, that is pretty much what we'll be uh, doing over, uh, over the next week or so. Uh, so, yeah, that's pretty much our plan. I might stream a little, uh, Lobami Corporation, a little, uh, other stuff here or there, too. But, for the most part, it will be just Kiseki, because we're gonna be finishing up, uh, Cold Seal 2 tomorrow. So, um, yeah. What else? Uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. That is, uh, pretty much what we're gonna be, uh, we're gonna be doing, needless to say, I don't know, maybe I will play some more Gang Over It again, too. Maybe, I don't know. Uh, it, it'll just mostly be Kaseki, though, for the most part, so, yeah, um... <sighs> But anyway, I got you go. I can't see it forever. Uh, you yeah, pretty much know the drill. So uh, thank you all for watching this wonderful stream. We hope you have one for us today, night, week, whatever. And I will see you all tomorrow, probably for uh, more Gartic phones. So yeah. Um. Good night, everyone. Stay classy, everyone, and good night. 
And I will see you all tomorrow for some more Gartic Pone. If that stream actually happens, uh, there's a bunch of things that could go wrong. But, uh, yeah, so, yeah, um, see you there, everyone.